everyone, it's Kara Shadow Skill again. We are back after like a year into Darkest Dungeon. And um, yeah, they added a new DLC, some kind of the Butcher's Circus. It's like, wait, oh, do, is that a separate thing? It's like a multiplayer thing. I guess we'll click on that up here and take a look at that. Anyways, if you like this video, please leave a like and comment. It does help out a lot. I do upload a new video to this channel and my Reacts channel every single day, so make sure you subscribe to both and hit the notification bell so you never miss out. I also stream daily on Twitch starting at 12 p.m. Central and then at 4 p.m. Central, so make sure you follow me there to catch when I'm live. Link is in the description. But without further ado, let's begin. <laughs> yeah, please, no deaths. That was like a, a hardest difficulty, no light, uh, no death playthrough. It didn't get very far. <laughs> For the dead and lone, but throwbacks and tracking streams more you remember, Zeph. You know what? For nostalgia's sake, let me open this file really quick. It's been so long. I want to see this file real quick. What's up, right? You've been diagnosed with autism. Oh, it's all good, man. We make the most of things. We make the most of things. That doesn't have to be like a terrible thing. It's all good, little app. I, I, I personally believe. Family name once so well regarded is now barely whispered aloud by decent folk. <laughs> but big eggs, little web. It's good to see you, my friend. I hope you're doing well. I'm glad you're enjoying the stream. I'm gonna add a bit, a bit of a nostalgia trip here. I want to look at some of these old names. These are probably I named my characters after um people from the stream. Uh, oh yeah, and <laughs> oh no, <laughs> that still happens. I saw that. Where was that? No. <laughs> Who? Who? <laughs> okay, it went away. I don't know if you saw it, one of my characters was, was, was turning. He was transforming. It happened for like a second. Did anybody see that? Lol? No, it was already. Yeah, yeah. Hoo hoo. No, 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 no. Okay, I guess, it, I guess it's gone. Ah! It's me! It's me! No! Why? No! What's happening to me? No! No! <laughs> Even a year later. <laughs> no. Not me, I'm not a monster. <laughs> no. <laughs> I was honest and bad. They have a little bigger than that. We're just a form of autism. And man, you're awesome just the way you are. Out of all characters, I'm confused. This is a very Lovecraftian game and it's very, very dark. Um, I already beat the game. Um, we're here for the DLC. But I just kind of, I, I kind of wanted to see my characters again. It's been a while. Just Cardinal! No! <laughs> oh, okay, you're, you're normal. <laughs> the game, after you beat the game, I mean, I, I mean, we're playing, should I even talk about this? Basically, like, the bottom line is you can't win. It, it's very HP Lovecraftian. You can't win against the old gods. You, you think you've won, but you really haven't. Um, you know, it, it just, it just really carries those vibes. Kogi! <laughs> But yeah, Stanley. These guys, dude, they're the um, the abominations. They transform into monsters. It's like stress out your whole party, but they do like crazy damage. I love these guys. Ashka, that's these are the healers. You know, she's got like a little book. She has healing magic, which is really nice. And then this, these are the jesters. They play music that, like buffs your party. They they can also de-stress your party because stress is serious. Like your your party members get really stressed out, and it it can really ruin your runs. Like they won't they won't obey you anymore. And it's very bad. H.P. Lovecraftian. H.P. Lovecraft was a writer. He wrote uh, what was the name of the book he wrote? Actually, I forgot the name. But it, it's the one with like you know Cthulhu, right? That's from H.P. Lovecraft. He he created that whole thing. Hunting Hornets. <laughs> you like every time another virtual machine hacking hacks your thing. Best of luck with that tech wing, and thank you for the lyric. I appreciate it. And this was the cultist. These guys are RNG healers. They can heal you for zero or they can heal you from like something massive like 19. These are the RNG healers. And I have videos on my YouTube of like pulling like I, I think he pulled a zero. And they can also bleed your teammate too. They have a chance to actually bleed you, the, whoever they're trying to heal. So if you get really unlucky, like it's bad. And I have videos where like I got unlucky and I was miserable. Like I was depressed. These suck, unless they ever buffed them. These are like archers. They're terrible. I tried to make them work. They are so bad. Uh, these are god tier. These are like broken. Like I bring two of these in my party. That's how good they are. Uh, or one, one or two, but I always have one. They, they, they can attack really far and they pierce armor. And they're like, they can uh, give themselves like invincibility and they can de-stealth targets. Like they're amazing. I love the shield breakers. <laughs> I have like so many right here. These are the, 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 what do they call these? Uh, the Crusaders. They're pretty, they're really tanky. They have a lot of health. Rappy, here's Rappy. Rappy was my first Crusader. Rappy was a kleptomaniac, though. You remember those dialogue? Yeah. Rappy was a kleptomaniac. Rappy had to get put in chains to, because Rappy kept stealing draggy shinies. So Rappy had to go in chains. I had to cure Rappy of kleptomania. <laughs> New Rappy, brah! The shinies are mine. 
I did everything I could to like make Rappy good, but the pack the fact of the matter is these classes just don't work super well in the end game. They're nice for sustain because they can give a heal and all. But like aside from that, they're like not amazing. Um I already told you about that one. Funny no! <laughs> Funny no! <laughs> Oh, and then uh, we had uh, the man at ours. <laughs> Rappy poses are cutesies. They're not shining at cutesies. Max, big X, Max, poses are cutesies. Shadow, the man at arms. These are the sword and shield guys. These were kind of like hardcore tanks. They could like protect your team and buff them. They didn't do too much damage, but they were pretty good for buffing. But I didn't. I never really felt like they were worth it. Gluten. And then Phonic, these bounty hunters, they were kind of cool. They could do really nice CC and they could mark targets. You could like move enemies around, bring bring the back line closer. Like bring the squishy healers to the front so your team can easily like smash them. Which is pretty nice. But personally, I didn't feel they were worth it. Then I played as the Highwayman, which they're cool with their, um, where is it? Duelist's Advance is pretty nice. I learned that pretty late though, uh, with the reposting and everything. But yeah, I, I I just felt like they were they kind of this character is like a jack of all trades, but a specialist in none. I like like he has ranged, which does good damage, and his melee which does good, but but like neither of them are like really good, you know. I already showed you that healer. I tried to make these grave robbers work, but I don't know. They they the positioning is weird, because you'll you'll see when we play the game the positioning of your characters is important. These, this one like moves around a lot, and it kind of interfered with my composition. These are literally trash. They're terrible for combat. They don't do anything good for you, but they exist to make you more money. You take them with you, it weakens you, but you make a lot more money if you bring them with you. That's what this character is for. Um, and then we have the poison and And then these guys, the plague doctors, they're really good. Like, like, like they're actually pretty cool with like damage over time. You can't burst people with them, but you can do like burst CC, like stun enemies, and you can like put really strong poisons on targets. So if a target is heavily armored, you can bleed them out pretty effectively with this character. But I found that they weren't worthwhile for two reasons. Number one, I have shield breakers that penetrate armor anyway, and number two, these guys are extremely squishy. And I noticed that when I was going against like mini bosses that were just completely unfair they would immediately focus these characters and like one shot them and i got so fed up with it that like i stopped bringing this character because they have like so their hp pool is so low it's like horrible these guys are also a tank they're they're tanks and and they hit pretty hard too um and if not for armor being a thing in this game they'd probably be like amazing but yeah they they, they stand on the front they do really good damage they're not very accurate so you have to you have to give them trinkets that improve accuracy but they hit really hard and they're very tanky but the problem is if a target is armored they won't do much damage because they don't they, you know it's it's they, they don't have ways of penetrating armor like the shield breakers do which is why i love the shield breakers and then we have the the hellion these are what I used early on before I got shield breakers because what makes her so special like she hits hard She's decently tanky not like amazingly she hits hard But she has this move which allows you to hit the person in the far back because she has like a halberd So if she's in the front she can actually hit a person in the far back of the enemy line, which is really nice So as you can see there's a lot of different characters and you can mix and match them like your party members Your party's made up of four characters and then these are the flagellants. These guys are weird these guys they don't have high HP, but like they they don't die easily like it's really weird It's hard to explain they like to get hit like these are the guys that like to whip themselves They, they take pleasure in pain like they're masochists and um I, I tried to make him work. I mean he has some cool stuff, but it's, it's weird I mean weird is good. You know, it makes it unique like the way you de-stress him is like he literally like he he, he like uh yeah, he, he whips himself to like de-stress himself. He's weird. So she uses a melee. Well, yes, but actually no, kind of, yeah. Poisons are gnomesies! No! Boys are not gnomesies. And then you have this guy. Ice block, man. I miss Captain Ice Block. Uh, but yeah, he um, this guy has the doggo. You can use the doggo to like comfort your companions so they get less stressed. And he can also um, guard your teammates. Um, to, to, to take damage that would have instead have been directed at your teammates, he'll take it himself. And he's got a nice stun too. So there's a ridiculous amount of variety. So we're going to have to kind of organize our, uh, make pretty significant decisions on team composition when we do the multiplayer. So why don't we actually dive right into that right now? What do you mean download it? I did download it. <gasps> no, was it like a separate thing? Oh no. I may have been the biggest derp known to man. <laughs> Are you for real right now? It's small, dude. It'll download fast. I promise. It'll download extremely fast. Bear with me. I'm not a derp! It'll download fast. Yes. 
Yes! Yes! Okay, all right, I don't know. Let me, let me, let me just close the game real quick, okay? It, it, I promise, I promise it'll be extremely fast. I thought I already downloaded this. No, 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 not the wishlist. It'll be extremely fast. Mm, love you too, basic call. One moment, one moment. We are going to open up a bingo for 500 snowflakes. You have to guess which of my emails was randomly chosen by the bingo to win yourself the 500 snowflakes. Where is it? This. Yes, download. Wait, it's already done? <laughs> what? Oh, okay. <laughs> well, anyways, yeah, 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 I guess it one by one. Yon, 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 yon. It's not any of those. Keep guys. No, 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 no. Those aren't the right ones. No, it's not the shorts. No, no. Okay, so is it. Am I done? I just did! Come on! I downloaded. Oh, wait, it's downloading now. Oh, there we go. There we go. Now I got it. I got it. For some reason, it's just. Okay, it's done now. It's done now for sure. Okay, okay, okay. Playing the game. No! No! Not the man chicken! <laughs> no! We're, we're gonna open up another bingo. Ex oh, wait, no, actually, ignore that one because it's gonna get canceled. Dang it. No, 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 no. Okay, okay. No, has come to our family. no, bad, bad. It was the salt. Okay, okay, okay. One moment, one moment. You That's gonna spam for a while. House. <laughs> we're gonna open up a raffle for 420 snowflakes. Exclamation mark join and join the raffle for 420 snowflakes. Exclamation mark join. Anybody's more than welcome to join the raffle. All you gotta do is type exclamation mark join and you are in. Good luck to everybody here. Show me what you got. Okay. There we go. The Butcher's Circus. It's time. Heroes have different skills and stats in the circus than they do in the single player campaign. Oh, they changed them. Interesting. A traveling bacchanal. A debauched contest of survival. The Butcher's Circus is all these things. And more. Wow, there's a lot to see here. It's the wool cold. Oh, I love you very much, Seth. All right, it would be the man chicken. Yeah, no, no, no. New DLC, that's right. Jump in. This is the Butcher's, uh, I already forgot what it was called. Butcher's Circus DLC. Yeah, yeah, Butcher's Circus. It's right next to my head. Um, it's PvP, so we'll check it out. Congratulations, Shadow Dream and Epic. I'm winning 140 Stealth Lakes. You deserve it. I know. How you doing, Jump? I haven't seen you in a few days. I missed you, bud. So here are my options. Hey, <laughs> Kappa Jet. And then, then, then the game, yes. Did it overlap both capogens? I don't know. Rig, no, no, stab rig. Okay, so on the top left, I have an option. It's my head is covering it, but it's my it's this banner right here that you see is highlighting behind me. I have an option to refashion my banner so I can design my banner. This is dueling grounds issue challenges. This is the ring find a match. This is ranking board, and this is prize box. Ooh, and down here we have. Oh, there's a bunch of trinkets. Less stress, higher virtue chance, debuff resist, okay. M less stress, more stun resist, less dodge. More stress dealt. I wonder how useful stress could be, we'll see. More blight chance, less blight resist, okay. More protection, more stress dealt. More stress dealt versus bleeding. More bleed chance, more crit. More stress dealt, more accuracy. Wow, it seems like stress is a big thing in this. I wouldn't have thought it would be, because they must make characters way tankier, because I feel like they would die long before they got stressed, unless they've significantly increased the stress. Plus 50% stress relief skills. Hmm. Maybe I should, but I'm not going to. You know what? Frick. Should I? <laughs> to, like, cut out all that other stuff? No. Very quickly, just in case. Well, well maybe we should start starting again. No, no, no. You know what? Okay, fine. We won't. We won't. We won't. Okay. We won't. We won't. We won't. It's fine. Uh, stun resist, move resist, damage and acting first, accuracy, blight resist, bleed resist, debuff. Yeah, yeah. Move chance. Okay. Death blow dealt chance. Whoa, that's new. Yeah, because, because yeah, that because it's PvP, that would actually make sense. Because death blow is, a, is only for your characters, but now that you're playing against another player, it makes sense. Okay. So you need a finisher. Someone needs that. Eerie Eye, debuff skill chance, ignores stealth. Ooh, okay. Damage versus afflicted. Oh, oh, Sanity's Bane, that's good. Brass Knuckles, more damage, more stun due, skill chance. There's a lot of interesting stuff here. Damage, bleed chance, dodge, accuracy, crits, receive chance, stress taken. Crushed Hemlock, blight skill chance, on melee attack hit, blight. Oh. 
More HP, more death blow resist. More healing received, more blight resist, more bleed resist. More protection, more max HP, more da melee damage skills, more crit. More damage, more accuracy. More death blow resist, more dodge at death's door. More healing skills. Damage and accuracy. And then there's like a oh, way more! Whoa! Alright, well, well, we'll look at those as we earn them. Claim your spoils. They are hard earned. And the previous owner will not miss them. Okay, so this is talking about the trinkets that I'm going to unlock later. Okay, interesting. I'm actually pretty excited to experiment with this ranking board. List, blood and courage are the only means to ascension. Season it. They have seasons? Dude, this is like looking like a hardcore competitive thing. Ha, no, no, I don't want to challenge my friends. I'm good. I'm good. Nope, I'm not ready, dude. I'm not. <laughs> you can actually challenge. You could duel people from your friends list. That's insane. No, boys, you can't use him. Not a play. No, 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 no. All right, I can change my banner, so we have that one. I don't have that many options. Oh, defeat the inchoate flesh. Is that a new monster? I'm not sure if I ever fought that. Slayer first boss. Win 100 matches. Prestige level. Oh, these are all about prestiges. Win a match using only stress. First match in the ring. Wait, let me see these. Win a match using only stress. That's crazy. Defeat the inchoate flesh. What is that from? Defeat the Sodden Crew. What? I killed those! I did beat the, the Sodden Crew. Also, I think I beat the Inquit Flesh too, no? Why don't I have this? Hmm. I guess I'll go with this because I beat the game. That seems like the most prestigious thing I have right now. No, 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 just, just, no, no, no. Save, apply. Well, can I do more to it? Oh! Oh, there's more customization. Win a match. Kill an enemy in the first round. That's possible? Kill all bosses. Yeah, let's go with that. Oh, jeez, I got the tentacles at the bottom. Boys, aren't you doing major? Oh, no, Jed, oh, yeah, you want to Bring it! Bring it! Oh, no, Jed, come, come fight me now! You don't even have this game. But I do eat, Bungie, Jed, do <laughs> Um, basic headpiece, very common. Cause an enemy to have a heart attack. Ooh. One hero survives five death door checks. So basically, you get really good RNG, you'll get this. Okay. Cause 150 heart attacks. Oh my lord. Uh, to cause heart attacks, you need to get someone else's stress to 200. Challenge real. Do you have this game, Kai? I want some practice first. Where is the dragon? Oh, actually, you know what? I'm tempted. I know I'm good. Thanks, my. <laughs> I would love some dragon stuff, but unfortunately, it doesn't fit. Red hook. Swine Prince. Dude, I beat the Swine Prince. What is this BS? I should have this. I beat the whole game. How can I kill every boss, but have not killed the Swine Prince? That doesn't make sense. This is buggy. Yeah, I slayed a Shambler. Yes, I beat the Sonorous Prophet. I defeated the Siren. Okay, this I haven't done. This is new stuff. Champions League. Darkest League. Defeat the Baron, yeah. Defeat the Sleeper. I'm pretty proud of that, actually. I'm going to put that there. Because it was pretty hard to get to that guy. I feel like I'm choosing these more based on like, um, like how significant it is versus like what, like if they're actually good. Kill each hero class? Well, we'll get that over time. One hero kills four enemies in a match? Wow. So one guy kills everyone. Kills six. I feel like I should like maybe like make a mental note of some of these achievements to like try to get them. No, I don't want to get something just for owning something. Yeah, I killed, I don't even know what these things are, but apparently I killed them. Maybe they're just regular enemies. No trappings, very common. Prestige, 10 enemies, one hero survives, four heart attacks, jeez, dude, that's, um, that's, that's really good RNG. Max prestige level, defeat the wizened hag, I beat that, I beat that too! Bring in Wolf, yeah, I beat him. Defeat the countess, yeah, I, I, I earned that, that was a tough one. Yeah, yeah, get that one, get that one. Defeat the miller, that's less prestigious than the, than the sleeper, but still pretty cool. Oh, no, not just for owning it, okay. This is my banner. 
Deserving champion. Deserving champion. I would challenge if I had it. Oh, I found the boy. No, you didn't. Hide the poison shadow. Poison Satan. No, so did the poison. They're not using shadow. No, 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 I them. Probably from an update. I might get this game right now just to challenge you. Oh, gosh. Wings. This game is brutal, Nightlight. Don't get attached to your characters because, especially in this mode, I imagine it's going to be sad. Who, who among my friends list actually has this game? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Wait, Dagon got this game? I never know that. knew that. <laughs> Failure, man. Phonic got the game. <laughs> Be like, hey, you're on stream. Fight me. <laughs> oh, man. I have a lot of friends who have this game. Hey, Zeph! Soldan has this game. Why don't I fight Soldan on stream? Wait, you have this game jumping. You have it. You have it. Shadow empowering Draggy. Thank you, Shadow Draggy Draggy, but love you very much. Have you played this yet? Mm -hmm. Shadow back. I love you very, very much. Mm -hmm. You know the character's last one? That's me. Yeah, the game sold on. Has it? Yeah, he has the game. He's an option here. He has the game, apparently. <laughs> Tell him if he wants to go, we'll go. Zephyr has it as well. That's a different Zephyr. Not, not Zephyr in the stream right now. Okay, that's it. Yeah, dude, if Soldan did not, heck yeah. <laughs> Tell him I'll duel him right now. Well, actually, maybe I should, like, actually make a team, because I don't even know how this works yet. Okay, is there anything else to look at? How do I form my team? I think I have to enter the ring to form a team, right? Do not be hasty in the assemblage of your contestants. Victory and defeat can be decided here. Man, you can see all the classes at the top now. Yo... I'll pay him right now, nice! Dude, I will make- you know what? No. If he- if he- if he's ready right now, he'll be my first fight. We'll go right now, him and me. He'll be my first one. So, let me see how they changed it. Can you- can you- yeah, you can- you can- yeah, yeah, okay, shut up. Yeah, so you can, okay. This is the same as it used to be. That's the same as well. Whoa, death blow dealt chance, that's new. That is new. Oh, there's a death blow. No, no, that, that, that's not new. This grape shot was always garbage. Uh, Vendetta. Bypass stealth. I never really liked this move very much. Duelist advance, this move is good. Open vein. Hmm. Then me fighting words, yeah, okay, so maybe I could go duelist advance with this guy. That's a possibility. I'll have to understand trinkets a bit better, too. What about you? Are you the same? So you have... The wicked hack, yeah. Iron swan. Higher death blow chance. Yo, that's a new metric. She seems like she's really good at doing death blows. 30%, 40%, yeah. Terrifying yop. Oh, it inflicts stress. It no longer does a stun. That used to be a stun. They changed it. It does stress. Hmm, I don't know. If it bleeds, this move was always trash. Breakthrough's good to, to reposition if necessary. This is good to clear debuffs and cure blight and bleed and heal and 30% more damage and 10 accuracy. Yo. Okay, Hellion is looking pretty strong. I might I might rock a Hellion. I might rock a Hellion actually. All right, I'll take that into consideration. Grave robber. Ping sure. There's something still there happened you yo. Alright, pick to the face. Armor piercing, no. Shield breaker does better armor piercing than you do. Lunge. Death blow chance. Okay, yeah. Flashing daggers. Debuff target. Bleed resist. Plus 50% stress dealt while stealth. So she could burst. More damage, more crit, and death blow chance. But that requires setup, dude. I mean, if you get nuked too hard early on, you won't have time to set up this burst. You would need some kind of tanky composition that can sustain, and then she, like, nukes people. Maybe. Thrown dagger, mm. panic darts, inflict stress plus 30, so you could double that, or no, plus 50%, 50% more, you can make it 45, hmm, clear, clear debuffs plus 15 dodge, I don't know, I never liked her in the core game, alright, and then you have your healer, uh, you will never use this, that's not how you're supposed to play her, judgment, uh, yeah, sometimes, it's, it's a good, it's, it's like, yeah, if you want to, if you want to get a bit more DPS. This is good. It's a stun and it inflicts a bit of stress. This is a str clear horror. You can wipe horror? Who, who does horror? That's, that's an enemy thing. Heal party, bypass stealth. It de-stealths, inflicts stress, and reduces an enemy's dodge. Ah. So she could be really good for, for countering a stealth enemy. A healer, a stunner, and a stealth counter. That's pretty good. Hand of light, plus 15% death blow dealt chance melee skills well she's not gonna be that close i'm not gonna play her like that 
Shieldbreaker. These are these are Bay. These are my favorite. I wouldn't be surprised if they nerfed them because of how good they are. Uh, yeah, you you have armor piercing, and they can reach. They can hit literally anybody in the entire enemy line. Anybody. So good. He seems busy. All right. Puncture bypasses guard. This is good if you if someone's getting guarded and you want to pull them out. She counters. She counters armor. She counters guard. And if she's getting focused, she can apply um, Serpent Sway, which will block attacks that she gets hit by, so it's really, really handy. Um, Impale is a good way to hit multiple targets into backup and you need to apply Poison. Adder's Kiss, that's like a really heavy hitter if the target isn't armored. Because the damage mod... But it, wait... 10%, 20%. And this is more Adder... You know what? I'm not gonna run Adder's Kiss then. I feel like I need a Shield Breaker, most likely. Expose is tempting. I can de-stealth a target. You inflict 20 stress, and they have a 20% higher chance to get hit with crits. But I would rather- this tar this person needs to be DPSing constantly. I think it's more important. But one issue with this character is that she's not good at, uh... She's not good at, um, inflicting death blows. So even- she might get people's HP low quickly, but she won't be able to do a death blow. Hmm. All right, well, 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 you know, we'll, we'll take a look at that some more. Uh, Plague Doctor, I seriously doubt I'm gonna use a Plague Doctor. But it seems like he can inflict stress and a heavy-duty dot pretty well. Yeah, he can do a lot of stress and poison. These are actually some pretty deadly poisons. Uh, this one inflicts stress. Oh, wow, you can, like, seriously stress backline. That's really good. But at the same time, like, my characters are gonna melt backline fast. Um, Cure Blight Bleed, nah. Emboldening Vapors. You can actually stack this on a person to seriously buff them. Disorienting Blast, Shuffle. Yeah. I need to have a composition that's pretty good against Shuffle, like to where Shuffle doesn't affect me too much. I never really liked the Man at Arms. Debuff, Protection, no. Uh, Knockback, Daze. I mean, he's got some CC, which is nice. I'll need to have someone in the front that's pretty resistant to movement in CC if possible. Inflict stress. So he can actually inflict stress like every round. And then he can guard ally, which this is what I need to counter with my shield breaker. Attribution. Damage all guarded. Buff. You get more dodge, less stress taken. This is a good buff. To pop this at the beginning is really, really good. Cultist. The thing about the cultist. Anybody? Wait, what? Oh, if anybody's gonna fight, I see. The thing that's cool about the occultist, he's an RNG heal, which is miserable. But. Wait, did they change him? Oh, no, no, it's right here. Yeah, yeah. See, 0 to 24. Like, you could get insanely... Imagine me fighting someone and they get, they heal, like, the 24 every time. I would lose my mind. And, like, I'm healing zeros. I would be furious. But anyways, yeah. Unfortunately, it is a thing with Darkest Dungeon. There is a lot of RNG in this game. <laughs> oh, my lord. If I see a cultist on the enemy team, I'm gonna melt him fast. But anyways, what he's good for... Oh, he applies horror. But, dude, if I kill the enemy before they have a chance to seriously stress me, I, I think if I burst enemies down fast enough, they won't be able to land the stress. I'm not going to worry about it too much. Um, but, yeah, I guess if you wanted to kill with stress... Oh! If someone's afflicted, you have a high death blow chance with this. Okay. What is this? Stygian Embrace Heal. Oh, you can stealth targets! Oh, my God! You heal someone and you stealth them. And they have 50% higher stress stealth while well, stealth? Dude, that's really good. I feel like stealth is going to be important. I'm going to need to bring some de-stealth. I'll, I'll, I'll bring plenty of it. Vulnerability hex. You can mark a target where they dodge less, inflict stress on them, and you mark them? Dude, the cultist actually looks really strong. Wow. And you can pull enemies. Horror plus 10 stress for 3 rounds. And you clear enemy corpses. Yeah. Pull 2. Yikes. The problem with the leper is that once you move him out of position, he can't do anything. So he's he's tanky, he hits hard, but he's counterable. He's he's too counterable. That's what's scary. But you have to respect a leper. When there's like a leper in the way, he's terrifying. He's really, really scary. You have to like shut him down. Yeah, he can give himself insanely high tankiness. If you're so you basically kind of need to either move the leper or ignore him because he's so tanky. Like you're wasting your time if you try to focus the leper down. Um and then we have our uh, what's his face? Um yeah, yeah, the the crusader. Crusader? Oh, you can inflict a lot of stress on the front line with this. Wow. Interesting. Okay. 
So they, they definitely made it so that characters can inflict a lot of stress. And then, yeah, you have the stun. I'm really scared of CC, dude. Clear deep. Oh, this clears debuffs? That's so good. Holy Lance. Yeah, they're good for repositioning. Clear horror as well. And plus 15% virtue chance. So even if your stress does get filled up, you have a higher chance of getting virtue. Wow, dude. I, I like this. Actually, some depth to this. I see a lot of depth to this. This is very interesting. He says, no one, like, I haven't even played the game. He has it, though. <laughs> People pop it. I'm functioning. That means he, you know, he should fight me. You just something to fight! That means he should fight me. Okay, yeah, it makes sense. This guy would inflict stress. Inflict stress and bleeding. Exsanguinate. This is someone I would also probably ignore. He's a, Plus, he gets strong when he's low on HP. So you always want to put off killing a flagellant. They thrive when they're low on HP. You kind of have to ignore him. Reclaim. Heal. Yeah, he's got a, like, stupid heal. He has really, really high heal. Stress. Minus 30. Suffer. Hmm. Hopefully they buffed this character because they sucked in, in uh, the core game. Um, so... Higher death blow chance versus marked. Okay. Inflict stress. Oh, they can put a debuff on them so they take more stress. Dude, this game is actually... I'm getting kind of... Ex I kind of want to theory craft and, like, experiment. Like, I'm actually kind of getting into this. Man, you can seriously nerf someone... Hit someone's dodge. You gotta kill fast, dude. This is kind of scary. I can do a knockback. Hmm. Blind fire to bypass stealth. Heal, cure bleed. De-stealth. De-stealths all heroes. And it clears a uh, marked target. It clears stun. Wait. Yo, that's really strong. Are you kidding me? It de-stealths every enemy, and it clears stun, daze, mark target, and debuffs on all of your allies in one move? Are you serious? That's crazy. I mean, I guess they had to offset, like, how weak she was, so they gave her an insanely good, like, clear. Yeah, I, I guess they changed up some abilities to make everything kind of viable. I'm really curious to see what they did to the anti-quarry in them. I think it just showed everyone was on online the on list is Really? I think it's a look at the monster's point of view. Yeah, it kind of does, Gallius. How you doing, bud? It's good to see you. Nerd, yes. Oh, Robbed you with the tornadoes, yes. Bounty Hunter. 90% damage versus Mark, so pretty much the same. Mark target, yeah. And then they have less death blow resist once marked in this way. Okay. The hook marks them. Yeah, so nothing new there. Uppercut. Yeah, this, this move was really nice. I liked it when it worked. <laughs> And then, yeah, like, basically, bounty hunters are, like, really good at CC. That's what makes them special. They mark and they CC really well. Yeah, and this is where you can shuffle a target and weakens their dodge. More damage versus stun, dazed, and higher death blow chance. Okay. Caltrops. Eh. Oh, but it affects everybody. You throw it on the ground. Plus 5% stress taken, and they take bleed, too. Okay. This is my favorite character to use. How long would you re reckon matches take with all these buffs and stuff? Oh, matches won't take long. I think they'll just be a few turns. I think matches will go fast. I'm spending probably the amount of time it's taking me to examine all these characters. I think like three or four matches could have already happened. <laughs> I don't. Fights in Darkest Dungeon usually don't last too long, unless they're like butts fu uh, boss fights. Welcome to Theory Crafting the Stream. Yeah. So here's the thing. When I played the game, let me tell you in the core game what my composition was. I had a shield. My dream team was one Shield Breaker, one Abomination. One Jester and one Vestal. Maybe it'll be the same. Maybe it'll be a little bit different. We'll see. I'm going down the line. I just want to understand what's changed. All right. So the problem with the Abomination, what makes him special, he hits really hard. Like really hard. And he can hit, reach pretty far too. But the downside is it stresses your team out a lot. Like when your team, when you, when your teammate turns into a monster, it scares your team. I mean, for understandable reasons. Uh, so yeah, as human... All enemies, um, plus eight stress per round for three. Wait, really? When you're a human, your enemies get stressed? Wait, what? Oh, no, I think, wait, as human. Wait, what? As human, all enemies, horror, plus eight stress per round for three rounds. I don't understand. I guess if you transform from beast to... Or, or maybe no, when you trans... I don't know. Anyway, self. So change to mode beast. You get more move resist, so he can't be moved as well. That's really good. Uh, you get more damage. And... Oh, you're dazed for one round. I'm not actually... I don't understand this very well, but okay. 
Um, and then, yeah, so I'm not too worried about the human ones. This is a stun, doesn't do much damage. This inflicts some poison, inflicts stress. Oh, it activates repost. That's new. But it's minus 80% damage. It's not going to be much. And then the stress reduction and then the heal. Now, these are what I'm interested in. So, Rake. Yeah, it looks like it does the exact same. You just keep shredding the front line. Turn after turn, you get stronger and stronger. This rage move is so good, dude. This thing hits hard. And you can hit up to line the third person in the row. It's really good. Slam. I don't use this very often. Bypass. Oh, it bypasses guard. And I can knock someone back. But who's going to be guarded in the front? Usually the people who are guarded are the back line. I can't imagine that I would use that very often. Hmm. Interesting. Thank you for the lurk, Peter. I pre- I'm bad, Peter! Man, thank you for the lurk. I love you. You're not salty, the butt guy. When I have a monster, my team to see for everyone who's not really there. I gotcha. Are you in channel? Um... Yeah, don't, don't advertise, don't advertise your channels here. Thank you, Nightlight. Yeah, yeah, no, no self-promo here. Be aware of that. Antiquarian. So normally this character is weak. It's the weakest character in the game. She makes you more money, but money's not a thing here. So they must have buffed her. What did they do? All right, so this is what it always was. You just stab people, but you can do it from any position. So that's cool. Up to position three. So if, for those who aren't familiar with Darkest Dungeon, you see how when I'm highlighting a move, there's like yellowish circles on the left and there's like red circles on the right. What that means is the yellow circle that's highlighted, like as opposed to say this one, for example, you only see two yellow circles that are the back left. That means she has to be in the back two positions in order to be able to use it. She has to be in the back. What this means is that she can be in any position in the team, position one, two, three, or four, and she can hit anyone in the enemy team from position one, two, or three. But she doesn't hit very hard, so I mean, you know, it's it's whatever. What is this? Uh, two points for three rounds, inflict stress. So you can do, so I mean, there are ways you could just put dots on people right away. So you could like, I can imagine people like stacking poison, like using this, and then the bounty hunter at Caltrops. Like there, there are different kinds of builds. I see stress build potential. I see damage over time build. I'm gonna try to go for burst damage, like spike damage build. That's what I'm gonna go for first. Take cover, um, you stealth, add death blow resist. So if you're being focused, you could do this to like escape, which is really handy. Flash powder. You bypass stealth, de stealth, you inflict stress. Okay. And you debuff their accuracy. Hmm. Dude, if people debuff the accuracy of my characters, it's gonna hurt. That's why I gotta burst people down fast. Heal party three. Oh, dude, this is a buff. They buffed this thing. You heal your party three rep points per round for three rounds. And you could stack that repeatedly. It's a heal over time? For the whole party? Are you serious? That keeps them off death's door. She could just stack that. And she could easily, see the, the advantage she has over a Vestal, when a Vestal is pulled out of position, it's a nightmare to get her back into position. And she doesn't have any movement abilities. Like you have to manually move her, which is horrible. Or usually what I'll do, I'll indirectly move her by moving everybody else forward. So the shield breaker, as long as the shield breaker isn't pushed into position four, this thing moves her forward. You can see in the description, it says forward one. So as long as she's not in position four, every time she attacks with this, she'll move forward one. So she'll get back to the front. And then we already saw from the abomination, um, what is it? When, when he transforms, he has plus 40% move resist. So it's going to be really hard to move him. He's not going to get easily moved out of position. And if I were to pick the Hellion, where's the Hellion? Hellion has this move, Breakthrough, which moves you forward one. And you can do it from any position aside position one, which you, you would want her to be in position one. That's where she's best because she could use Iron Swan. You can tell I know a lot about this game. I, play, I streamed this game a lot in the past. I'm just new to the PvP, but a lot of the moves are very similar. So, I might actually replace Vestal. I might replace her. I might run either a Cultist or an Antiquarian. I, this, this seems really good. So I don't have to heal a specific member. I just apply the buff, and this will get people off Death's Door. That looks really good. Yeah, hi, the boys. Oh, the boys not you. Maybe just a little bit Yomji sometimes. I never have been Yomji's never will be. And you can buff Party Dodge as well. Um, protect to be Force Guard by Ally. Buff target, plus 10 dodge, plus 20% protection. Dude, I might actually run the Qu Antiquarian instead of the Vestal. Woo! Have a new Wiggly! Gallius one! Thank you so much for the follow chat. Spend the butts, send the lips, send the likes, send the loves, send the paws. Show Gallius one your love and support and appreciation for that follow. Thank you so much, friendo. I appreciate it. It means a lot to me. Thank you. Thank you for the support. And then we have... Wait, isn't this the same as the... This was just a skin. It's supposed to be the same as the crossbow chick. Did they change it?
they did change it a little bit. And the moves are very similar, but it works the same way. Buckshot. Oh, I think that's new. You can knock back. It hits the front two enemies half damage, but it can knock them back. Wow. But 85% base, that's not a very high knockback compared to like... This is like 100% base. Yeah, so it's, it's not super likely to work. Quick draw. Random target. 30% damage when acting first. Oh, wow. So if she makes the first moves, it would be a heavy hitter. Heal up. That's a much stronger heal than what it was in single player. Was your, was your heal the same? Yeah, it was. Cures bleed. What does yours do? Plus 25% healing received. Okay. Raging ranging shot. De-stealth all heroes, and then all heroes you get minus 12% uh, minus 12 stress, plus 10 accuracy, and minus 10% stress taken. I like the accuracy buff. Hmm. I don't know. Jester, what does he do? <laughs> Girl, we, I, 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 oh. We're gonna open up a bingo for 500 silver. So you have to guess which of my emotes was randomly chosen and win yourself the bingo. Get to guessing. Dirk stab plus 10% death blow chance. Okay, finale plus 40% damage. That gives you the buff for the finale. Harvest. I was never a big fan of those moves. I just used him to buff mostly. Finale. This move is scary. Bypass death door. Oh. So it's a guaranteed kill. If you finish someone off with finale, they're dead. But then he's dazed for three rounds afterwards. That's scary. Oh shoot, dude. No, boys are killed. You don't screech at the boys. No, 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 no. That's terrifying. So if the enemy has a jester, the thing about jesters, they have high dodge though. If I focus too hard on jester, I might have trouble hitting him. You know. That's scary. Solo, this is the thing you use before, um, yeah, mark target finale. Yeah, yeah, this is what I use right before a finale, the solo. Inflict stress. Mortal wound. Minus 20% death blow resist. Hmm. So that's about the death blow. Oh, you only use this once! 20 accuracy to the entire party, just like that? Ooh. Minus 20% stress taken. Minus 30. So this is like a huge stress reduction. But is it worth it? I mean, if these fights are short and quick, I don't know if this move is actually worth it. But right off the bat, yeah, you could buff accuracy. So my moves can... What accuracy does? Accuracy is like the other side of the coin to dodging. It was the girl bad! Congratulations! I'm not bad! I'm not dead! I'm huge! Accuracy is like the opposite of dodge. So uh, dodging, of course, is... Um, you know, your ability to dodge an attack. The higher the enemy accuracy, the more likely they are to hit you despite your dodge. So, I'm less likely to miss. That's a pretty big accuracy buff. That's very tempting. That's very, very tempting. I'm considering that. Houndmaster, what did they give you? Hound's Rush. Okay, you can hit anyone and apply a bleed. Yeah, I mean, the damage isn't that great, though. Hound's Harry applies a bit of a bleed and inflicts stress. Okay. Dude, there are definitely ways you can do heavy-duty stress. I see that. Can you imagine? Dude, that's that's so evil. Like, to try to kill your enemy by stress. And I'll try to do it. If I have time today, I'm going to build a comp for, like, killing with stress. I'm going to try to build a stress comp. Just, like, troll the heck out of my enemy. And just watch them freak out. There's no big right now. <laughs> target whistle. Mark target. And they have less protection. We don't need that because my shield breaker can penetrate just fine. Cry Havoc. Yeah, minus 15 stress for everybody. Yep, that's pretty strong. Guard Ally. Minus 70% stress taken while guarded, plus 50% debuff resist, and you get more dodge. That's really good. Lick Wounds. Heal HP and heal over time. That's a strong heal. Blackjack, so for a stun. That's really good. Cause of Death. Ah! Yeah, I mean, it really is. Okay, we've gone through the list, and we haven't even looked at the trinkets yet, so what characters are we going to choose? Well, here's the thing. I want to burst people down, right? I want to burst them down fast. Shieldbreaker penetrates armor really quick. So Sh Shieldbreaker does two things that's amazing. They can hit anybody easily with the spear. Like, you can see all of the red circles are lit up, so I can hit anybody. She's kind of squishy, though. 30 HP. If she gets focused, I can activate this move, Serpent Sway. But the problem is, um, dots will go through it. So bleeding, poison, I have to be careful about that. It's not foolproof, but it's pretty good. If someone is running a comp like mine, this will counter it. Um, but if they're running a, he a dot heavy comp, I'll be in trouble with this if they focus my shield breaker. But that's why I'm going to have a healer. Um, and then we have Puncture. Breaks the guard, so the target cannot be guarded and it pulls them. It does a lot of things in one. And then we have... 
Yeah, because I think for heavy duty guarding, I think this is important. Otherwise, guarding is going to be a problem. Alternatively, I can try to CC the one that's guarding, but they could be heavily buffed, you know? So I'd rather break the guard. I think that's better. Let's remove Impale. Impale is good if I need to move backwards, which sometimes is a thing. Adder's Kiss. We could bring the stealth move. Crits receive chance. De stealth. Inflict stress. Hmm. Days. Uh, she's not really a CC person, but yeah, I could try to daze something. I feel like expose is good. De stealth a target. If I needed to back my character up, I could de stealth someone and back them up in the same move. Yeah. Woo! Every new wiggly! Callisto84! Thank you so much for the follow, Jets. Spend the butts, send the blips, send the licks, send the loves, send the paws. Show Callisto84 your love and support and appreciation for that follow. Thank you so much, friend. I appreciate it. It means a lot to me. Thank you for the support. Makes sense. Our bounty hunter with the finish of skill with the fisher tree is pretty strong. Sounds makes sense. Captain George Gasm. George 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 Captain Gasm. I actually missed that very pop and I was so I was so distracted. I'm not a big fan of bounty hunter though. Like I mean it takes time, you know. I want to burst something down fast. But I guess with the whole death storm mechanic, there's only so fast you can burst. But it makes sense, yeah. Finish him, you can get like devastating damage. And I think it bypasses a death store really, really well, yeah. But yeah, I'm thinking. I want to try a shield breaker. Okay. Now, what trinkets? What are the... Can I organize these? Yeah, yeah. Oh, there are no class re restrictions. No, no, stop. Okay. Um, I want you to have... Max health might not be bad, actually. Maybe. Hmm. On melee attack, it blight. Hmm. That might not be bad because it, uh... If I put a dot when I stab and I do a lot of damage, I can put that dot on anything, which increases my chance of getting through a death's door. Now, I do want more damage. More damage, more accuracy. Debuff skill chance. <gasps> you ignore stealth! Ooh. Ooh. That's really good. Plus 10% damage when acting first. Okay, before I decide on this, actually, hang on. Who's my other guy gonna be? Who's my other guy gonna be? Who, who I, I wanna have... Okay, okay, okay. I wanna have two frontline, right? So... Man, if I ran a flagellant... Well, yeah, but he can only do the heal. I mean, he could do reclaim. The Antiquarian can do the- but, but I guess everybody has to make their move before this procs, right? So if every- if a, a single target is getting focused, I won't be able to heal them right away. But I could probably mitigate the damage somehow. Like, hmm... I don't know. So many good choices! Ah! So, let's talk frontline options. I want a shield breaker because I want to bypass guard. And I want to bypass and I want to bypass armor because I don't want to use dots to do that. I want to do it with raw damage. So let's rock the shield breaker, okay? The other front line, I say, either needs to, it needs to be someone who can move a lot. I don't want CC to be too devastating to me. We could either rock a Hellion or a Hellion. The advantage of using a Hellion, Hellions hit hard and they have a higher death blow chance, which is really good. And I can hit the back line too. Before I got into Abominations, I loved Hellions. So, I mean, I, I see potential here. And... Bleed out. Self. I never really liked this move. Um, plus, this is insane. Clear debuffs. More damage. More accuracy. Cure Blight Bleed. Heal 4 HP. That's crazy. And you can reposition just fine. Yeah, I would probably, like, run something like, uh... Inflict stress, minus accuracy. Yeah, I'd probably run a build like this. Hit, you can hit one, two, th and four. Um, you can move back if you if you get shifted out of the way, no problem. But you lose damage when you do that. And you can buff in this regard as well. I uh, know, Dizzy, yeah, it's a lot of information, right? Don't worry, we'll figure it out, though. So, I would say either the Hellion. 8 to 17, 9% crit, 10 dodge, 39 HP. Whereas the Shieldbreaker, where, where's the Shieldbreaker? So 8 to 15, you do less damage, but you penetrate armor, you have higher crit, higher dodge, more HP. Okay, 
That's good. Uh, but I feel like shield breaker is a must have for what for what I'm building towards. The problem with the leper is that if he gets moved, he's in trouble. I can't let him get moved. Um, he'll be very hard to reposition. I don't want to use a leper. Crusader can reposition really well, actually, with the Holy Land, so that's fine. But, hmm, Clear Horror, I'm not too worried about this. Clear debuffs is nice. Stunning Blow can be handy if you want some CC. Protection, wait, you buffed the whole party? Oh, you buffed the whole party with this. Um, but yeah, that's not gonna help you against dots. I'd rather just do a lot of damage, inflict stress. I'm not feeling the Crusader. No, no, I'm not feeling him. Uh, what about... And yeah, you were saying finish him? I mean, that's a really high death blow chance. Hmm. Abomination hits so hard, and then when you change to beast, you do even more damage. And I, I mean, you can shred the, the position three. You can rake the front line, like you have a lot of damage. The only problem with this, though, is I don't have anything that's really good against, um... Against, uh, what should I call it? What's the word I'm looking for? Oh, uh, English, what was I gonna say? Oh, yeah, Death's Door. I don't have, I don't have anything that's really good at death blowing. So, I mean, I might, someone might be at zero HP and I might hit them like three times and get nowhere, you know what I mean? They might, they might survive. That's the only problem. That's why I kind of feel like I might use a Hellion. But, like, his damage is just so freaking high. What I don't understand is if you change to a beast, like, do you immediately, uh... No, you get, you get move resist. But yeah, he can, he can, like, he can hit really hard. <laughs> but the problem is, dude, what about stuns? Like, if, if I ran into a comp that was CC heavy, they could stun my team pretty quickly. They're not gonna stun everybody, though. Hmm. Here, my t-shirt, doors are yeah, 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 yo. You know what? You know what? No, 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 okay. It, I think it's about time we played the video game, okay? I think it's about time we played the video game. So... No, you go here. Alright. I'll, I'll give them trinkets in a moment. Um... Now, normally I would run the Jester. Let me, let me look at the party-wide buffs real quick. Like the ones that are like, oh, use per battle one. So bypass stealth, minus 20 dodge, you get 30 damage accuracy, crit, ignore stealth. Hmm, I don't know. Let me quickly look at all the use per party ones, because those were changed. Just to see if there are any significant buffs I should consider. Well, that one, eh. No, where are you or have you? Emboldening vapors, dude, nobody's gonna give you time to buff. I know you have one. More dodge, less stress taken. Okay, not, not really that great, to be honest. I mean, compared to other things I could be getting. And as a healer, do I want a cultist? I mean, cultist, what's really cool about the cultist is, yeah, he's, he's got good death blow chance. The heal is RNG, though. Hmm. Mark target. Heal, stealth, stress stealth. I don't know, man. I'm not thinking. I don't think so. Uh, you... What do you have? Solemnity. Revenge. You've got some pretty heavy-duty buffs. So you have... Where, where was it? Yeah. Bulwark of Light. Buff party. Everybody gets 20% protection. It's pretty good. What do you have? Okay. What do you have? You have this, which is pretty cool, but I don't want to use you, really. Do you have anything? You have the Caltrops. That supplies a bleed and more stress. Hmm. So, the thing about the, um... The Abomination, I really want his attacks to connect. Maybe I'll still run the Jester, plus he'd be really good to finish- to- to kill enemies. Does he have a good death blow thing? Yeah, I could actually... Minus 20 death blow resist. Finale can bypass death's door. Hmm. Dirk stab. And you have a uh, buff party dodge. You have the... 
Yeah, okay, all right. So we need to go, just got to get your dead cells come out of Bobal. Nice, nice. Lurk, thank you for like Shadow Eye Preach. Lurk, let's type sure thing, Kai. I'm thinking I'm going to run Jester because he has a good way. But I mean, that requires so much setup and then it pushes, it pushes the Abomination out of position. The Abomination can only use this move when he's position one or two, and he would lose his progress on Rake, so I have mixed feelings about that. This requires too much setup, but giving 20 accuracy right away is really nice. And this moves forward. You could do Mortal Wound, minus 20% death blow resist. And where can you do Finale from? You have to be in position one or two. Yeah, it's not going to work. way to kill people when they're in when they're in death blow dude that's the only concern hmm what about antiquarian so you're going to have your squish and your dodge is pretty bad but my swim percent plus 20 percent death blow resist you can de-stealth targets which is really good and it also debuffs their accuracy. You can buff party dodge. Hmm. And heal over time. Or, yeah, yeah, you know what? I feel like she should be my healer. So who's the fourth character? Someone who can... Hmm. Bounty Hunter can function in position three, right? Yes, he can. Uppercut needs to be in the front, too. You can mark for death. It gives us de more death blow. Uh, it reduces their death blow resist. That's good. But then I feel like I would need something that works really well with marked target. Which, I mean, yeah, he can. But, like, something else, too. Hmm. Shuffle. Finish him. Stun dazed. Caltrops. So now I can outright kill somebody, I can only use it once, gotcha. It seems to daze him for three turns, too. But the problem is, if I'm running Abomination, I don't want to push the Abom- The finale only works when the Jester's in position one or two. And if my Jester's starting in position three, he has to move up to position one, two, either with like a Dirk stab or the solo. And then the enemy knows, oh god, you're about to go for the finale. I need to heal that guy, so they're gonna heal him, and then suddenly, suddenly the finale doesn't work, you know what I mean? I'm not gonna use this stone, is there a night yumsy? But dude, okay, we've been in here too long, I want to play the game. Um... I want something in position three that's really good at finishing off uh, people in who like with death blow. Point blank. Well, that's point blank. You need to be wicked slice. You could, have, but you can only hit positions one and two. Rise, if I'm not mistaken. Who can the bounty hunter hit? Bounty hunter, bounty hunter. Where are you? You can hit. Oh, you can only hit one and two as well. What about grave robber? What can you hit? Because once once this guy gets moved to position three, what can he do? He has to do slam. Breaks guard, cannot be guarded. And it'll move him up, but like, then I lose my progress on rake, and I lose my ability to do rage, which is so good. Yeah. Whoever's in the back needs to not be like shuffle. Dark is dark. Yo! Big guys, are finish him his first three. Finish him his first three. Oh, is it? Let me see. You're right. It's a higher death blow chance. Ooh. Okay, I think we have our composition. We're gonna try this. Where this? Okay, 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 okay. I figured out my team. Now I just need to figure out what they're going to use. All right, you. Yeah, how are you doing, Arcane? I'll try not to get us killed. And Arcane, mm -hmm. thank you so much for that nitro boost once again. It means a lot to me. I love you so much, my friend. Uh, death blow dealt chance. Oh, there are just trinkets that do that right away? Okay. Well, maybe I'm stressing too much about the death blow then. Uh, damage versus a flick. No, no, no. Stress dealt. Move skill. Gen no. Well, move skill, yeah. Put that on the. Put that on you. Okay. Uh, Blight, uh, Protection, Stress Delt. Minus Stress Taken, uh, Stress Taken. 
plus 15 dodge. Accuracy. Crits receive gem plus 3%. Hmm. More dodge, more accuracy. I could give that to my shield breaker and make her really, really squirmy. Who has... So, she has 20 dodge already. 5, 10, 15. If I give her this, she's going to be really, really squirmy. Let's do that. Where, where was it again? Uh, I lost it. Yeah, plus, so more dodge, more accuracy. I see all the moves. Thank you. Hello, Arcane. I love you, bud. This way to be a full glory. That on the bounty punter is 75% chance to kill. What is? What, what was the charm you were talking about, actually? Oh, I see what you mean. This one. Wait, where was it? Uh, the finisher, this one. Okay. Pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah. Plus 20 accuracy versus HP below 140%. Hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Um, do, 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 do. I'm derping so hard right now. So yeah, she could dodge. Great, great, great. Um, I'm gonna build this guy for damage. So... Damage, stun, day, skill, chance, no. 40, stress, del... Oh, no, sorry. Uh, stress, del... And I don't want him getting CC'd. Okay, so damage, accuracy, that's great. Plus 12 accuracy, ignores stealth. 30% stun resist, 30% move resist. Uh, plus 10% damage when acting first. Minus 4 accuracy. I like that. I don't want him getting CC'd. Suck snuff. Protection damage, accuracy, really good. Maybe on the shield breaker? Damage melee skill, super cent crit. I need well accuracy is important because you don't want to miss. So I would prioritize accuracy, but I mean crit is RNG. Stress taken, debuff, stun resist, dodge, protection, blight, bleed, debuff. Stress dealt, blight skill chance, no, damage versus afflicted. Death blow chance versus afflict no, that's no, stress stuff. Healing. I could give uh, you more healing, yeah. More bleed chance, death blow dealt chance. Sure, we could try it on him. He could be like a really good finisher. We're almost done, dude. We're almost done. Boys, he's having musies! Stop having you that I'm boys and you and I'm boys and musies! I ran out of world and Terraria. Oh, nice! There's only a made that happen. Now I'm just drawing how you. Wait, really? Yo, you'll have to tell me more about it. That's exciting. Damage lane, then a high death chance. You, you can secure... Yeah, yeah, he can secure kills with a death chance. Okay, one more treat in for this chick. I need her to stay alive. Um... I need her to stay alive. Let's try... Uh... Anything to, like, increase survivability. Maybe protection? Well, what about dots, though? Stress, blight resist. Healing received, blight resist. Now, to protect her against dots, I guess, but she could still melt. I mean, protection's only gonna do so much. I don't know. We're gonna roll with this. Now, let's decide on the abilities, and that's it. So, with this comp, of course you want this. This is amazing. This is good, too. Bypass a guard. Um, yeah, D stealth. Impaling is tempting. You apply, you could apply a dot to everybody. It will move me back, though, but I could always move back in. Because this is my only D stealth move, isn't it? It's the only one I have. But you could also argue that if I use Impale, I'm gonna hit everyone anyway. Hmm. I'm gonna roll with this. You. Wait, what? No, 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 put him back! Oh, please don't tell me. Okay, didn't reset it. Good, good, good. Uh, well, your skills are set in stone. What about you? Yeah, of course, we want collect bounty. Mark for death, I think, is good if something's being really stubborn. Flashbang is really good. Caltrops. I like the idea of the caltrops, and let me explain why. That bleed is another chance to go through death's door. So even though I'm not a dot build, it just, you know, it, it, it's just something I can put from the beginning. So that when people are at death's door, it's, it's another potential chance of them dying. So I think the Caltrops are still useful for me. He's going to be in position 3, so no value out of Uppercut. Run the Caltrops. Hither is... tempting? Hmm. 
We want finish him for sure. Uh, so deciding between these two, come hither. The thing is, if the hook misses, then it like doesn't even matter. Well, at 120 accuracy, hmm, and the pull might not work. It, it basically does nothing. Like it's so much. Hmm. I like that this shuffles a target, and um, it also debuffs their dodge. Well, okay, what if I use Finish Him instead of Collect Bounty? What's the difference with this? This has a lower crit chance, and this is more damage against Stunned, which we're not even really going to have Stunned. We have a higher move chance, though, so why not? Yeah, yeah, we, sh we should have some movement skills. Mark for Death. More damage for Smarked. I'm not really using him for damage, though. I'm using him more for CC. Yeah, I use him more for CC. He's more for CC. I'm not using him for damage. So I would say... Man, what if he gets hooked, though? He doesn't have good movement. He won't be able to back up very effectively. I'm not even sure if he's the right choice, but we're going to use him here. I'm going to commit. Uh, but we definitely want to implement some CC. So finish him is definitely something we need to keep. Caltrops I would keep, too. Hmm. Uh, and I'm actually waiting right now. Nice. What do you mean to tell you how your experience is going so far? Yeah, yeah, everything. Tell me all about it. Dots. Oh, dots don't proc death's door? Oh, they do in the single player. They don't do it here? Oh, that's weird. Okay. Um, flashbang, I feel like, is a must. Come hither can be good. Hmm. It marks the target, too, so you can follow up with the hook. Accuracy base 110, accuracy base 120. Shuffle single. Hmm. It debuffs the dodge, too. That's why I really like that one. This does the marking, but I mean, I can only hit position 1, 2 anyway. But I guess if you've hooked him in, that's fine. I say use the shuffle. I'm feeling that one more. I have more options with it. Okay. Now, Antiquarian, what am I going to use for you? So, invigorating, okay, okay, so flash powder, oh, we have two ways to bypass stealth, I forgot I had this, so if someone's stealthed, I can deep, I can hit them with flash powder, that's a must, you, these two are a must for sure, festering vapors, nah, run this heal instead, buff party dodge, I mean, the way I see it, I'm probably gonna be stacking this heal, I could buff dodge too though, that, that could buff dodge significantly, that could really annoy my enemy, and then of course it's nice to have a bit of damage, and then if I'm getting pressured, I can pop this. Stealth and um, Death Blow Resist. This one is a Force Guard. Increased dodge and protection on target. Hmm. I mean, I don't really think she's very rarely going to be doing damage. I would say like this. D-Stealth when needed. Otherwise, stack heal or dodge, I would say. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. Oh, I haven't followed you. One of your has two people kill giant spider. Nice, got two people. What's well, fun hearing you with your guys say this? I hate to look ridiculous. All right, sure thing. I already have a good one. Yeah, and I'm about to go in. Uh, can you rename your characters, by the way? Oh yeah, you can. <laughs> Who wants to be in my first composition? Because we're about to get started. Who wants to be in my first comp? Yeah, you have to be a subscriber. Plog. I have a shield breaker. She's got a spear. She penetrates armor. I have an abomination, he turns to a monster and shreds people. I have a bounty hunter, he like moves people around and he finishes people off. And I've got the antiquary, which is like the support, like buffing people's dodge and heal. You wanna be A-bomb? I'll go in with the spear, all right. We have our shield breaker, which is going to be Zeph. I'm gonna feel so bad if I get you killed. And then <laughs> it's gonna be jumping. Wait, why didn't it back? Oh, you can't hold it, you have to press it. Jumping. All right, that leaves the finisher and the healer. And then you just don't kill me. All right, do you, do you want to be the guy who finishes them off like a hunter? Or do you want to be the healer? I imagine you'd be the bounty hunter. I may bomb, yes you are. Yes you are. Free. All right, this is going to be arcade. Who wants to be the support healer? Anybody want to be the support healer? Going once. Going twice. I volunteer tribute. All right, Kai is the support. Oh, I really don't want to let you guys down. I'm ready. New 
blood in the ring. You have limited time to decide a course of action. The torch burns down, your turn is lost. Oh, so you have to go fast. Oh, shoot. Okay. Bounty Hunter, yes. So the first thing we should do is transform as the uh, Abomination, I think. Flawless victory. Okay. Oh, the Shadow Blood. The rabble thrills to the spilling of blood. Any memes necessary. We will kill the meme man! Meme man is no match for me! Oh god, he's played the game a lot. He has the things I have too. Interesting. Dude, I'm actually scared. I go first! The contest begins. Transform! Okay. Act now. Mm. Hmm. Dude, this actually looks like a comp I would rake. Hmm. Do I want to rake him or do I want to shred the anti -core? I'm gonna shred the anti in real quick. No, no, I'm gonna rake. I'm gonna rake. Let's go, baby. I'm ready. Your turn, bud. What are you gonna do? Come on, me man. The buffoon is flummoxed. You are flummoxed. You are flummoxed. Nya, 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 nya. You son of an orange sheep. <laughs> oh my god. Really, the first thing I get hit by is a crit. Oh. Okay, okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Okay. Hmm. I'm gonna keep raking, actually. Oh, you can't do the same character. Right, right, right. Okay. <laughs> uh, hmm. Wait, I shouldn't have done that. I should have done it to the archer, actually. She's probably gonna back him up, probably, if I had to guess. Yeah, move. I knew it. Wait, that was kind of a bad move on their part, actually. All right. Hmm. All right. Well. Act now. Yeah. Read. Over you. Automatic. No. Rage. Be rage. No. 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 All right. Your move, bud. Go on. We can do this. I'm back. What I missed. We're fighting. We're fighting. What's he doing? He's targeting come hither. Quickly Dude! Two crits in a row! What is going on? This is BS! <laughs> this is actually ridiculous! Oh, he's revealing his stealth. This is horrible, dude. I actually understand this person's composition now. I understand what they're doing. Okay. I need to move this this archer now. Get her out. There we go. She can't do much from there. I know what this guy was trying to do. He was going to hit her because she's marked now. He's thinking what to do. He doesn't know now. Probably point blank shot if I did take it. Oh, he's, yeah. Thank God, not a crit, finally. Finally. All right. Okay. Let's see. What do I want to do here? Hmm. I think he's going to be on. <laughs> <laughs> Not looking so hot! Oh, what's Mr. Double Crit Man gonna do now? What's Mr. Double Crit Man gonna do now? Huh? Finally, some good RNG, thank you. What's Mr. Double Crit Man gonna do now? Huh? What is Mr. Oh, I already used him? Oh, I did. What is Mr. Double Crit Man gonna do now? Hmm. Ah, oh, damn it! I tried my luck. I didn't get it. But I'm gonna scare him now. Now he's scared. He's scared. He's gonna want to save this person. He doesn't... He's probably gonna pop a heal. 
That's not what I expected. I, I literally don't care about that, actually. <laughs> um, hmm. Let's pop... Hmm, do I want to pop a heal? Or do I want to pop a dodge? I'm going to pop dodge, actually, because honestly, pretty irritated by what's been happening, this RNG, so I want to not take a hit. He's kind of stuck with what he could do with this chick. Oh, I can see what moves he has equipped. I didn't know that. He has to... Yeah, I really boned him. I boned him by moving. Yeah, yeah, he has to move now. How long does this last for? Is it done yet? Oh, it's my move now. Okay, okay. So first things first. Finish this guy. Yeah, baby! What are you gonna do now? No, 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 calm down. He surrendered! Woo! GG, baby! We win! He surrendered. We got it. <laughs> I think he rage quitted, dude. <laughs> yeah, baby! First win! We made the enemy rage quit, and I got a flawless victory. Hell yeah. <laughs> what did I get? Leper, I don't use leper, ringmaster, okay. Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> nah, nah, you don't win. We went to team. Draggy wins. And we went with the Wigglies. Yes, she got, we got it. We got it. Wait, did I get an achievement? What did I get? Or I, I don't know. Oh yeah, because I made a rage quit. That's because good old days when I first was screaming everything, blaming RNG. Dude! His only first two attacks were crits! They both critted! You can't tell me that's a like complete BS, man! Okay? <laughs> Two crits in a row, like the first two moves. I'm gonna bring the same exact comp. Let's keep rolling it until until it doesn't work. <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> the ringmaster demands a challenger. I'm ready, dude. Bring it, bring it. <laughs> nya, 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 draggy pro. It's I am not a play. Draggy pro, draggy pro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm not a pleb! You are not a pleb! It's lying, Draggy Pro, not pleb! <laughs> We're gonna open up a bingo for 500 snowflakes. You have to guess which of my emotes was randomly chosen to win yourself the bingo and all the snowflakes, my friend. Good luck to everybody here. Show me what you got. The temper shine is HH Pro. Oh, look at this pleb banner. Look at this pleb banner. Look at my pro banner. You are no match for me. Of course, he could just be like faking it. Oh, jeez. The resolve is broken. You have won. <laughs> A cacophony of bloodthirsty delight. Draggy pro. Boy, he's pro. Yeah, it's so good. I'm so pro. He got scared by my banner. It was an intimidation tactic. <laughs> I'm so pro. I intimidated him with my pro banner that he he got scared and ran away. <laughs> this is actually going a lot better than I thought it would. <laughs> yeah, it might have been the internet. I don't know. Trinkets and trophies are yours to claim. Plague doctor only, ringmaster. Master, okay. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> oh, all right, let's try again. <laughs> yeah, the bingo's still going, right? I think. Oh, it was the rip. Yeah, they got ripped big time. That's right. <laughs> all right, let's try again. <laughs> that was gold. Dude, I'm gonna, I spent more time theory crafting than like these fights are actually like going for. <laughs> wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Well, <laughs> all right, two flawless victories. Let's keep it up. Wiggle, wiggle, dance. All right, what are we up against now? Oh God. He has a pretty sophisticated banner, actually. Doesn't matter! Pawsies are pro! Pawsies will win! We can do this. We can do this. No, 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 no. Pawsies pro, Pawsies will win. Okay. Got it. I can see his abilities. I need to learn these by name. Enemy goes first. Make your move. Uh-huh. Make your move. 
It's his turn, right? Yeah, it's his turn. All right, go. He's picking his cultist first. Interesting. What are you gonna do? Wait. Oh yeah. I'm so done with this game, dude. Are you serious? Can my enemies not crit? I'm never bringing a Vestal to this mode. <laughs> like, ever. <laughs> Come on, you have high CC resist. Oh, not a crit, miraculous. It's not like he has a trinket that I gave him that gives stun resistance or anything. This literally could not be going worse right now. <sighs> what do I do? Hmm. Doing damage I just don't think is very helpful right now. We need to CC something. This bloody RNG, man. Oh, that was the worst way he could have gone, but alright. <laughs> Oh, whatever. It's fine. Dude, that's so bad. That literally couldn't have gone worse. That's literally the worst case scenario. Holy hell, dude. Well, 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 it would I'm getting no value out of this dodge buff, by the way, FYI. Oh, thank God it didn't crit. Oh, you resisted when you have, like, no resistance. Okay. <laughs> Talking, thank you. What are you gonna do? Oh, they're trying to focus down my shield breaker. I'm gonna need to do something for her. Panic darts. Oh, all right, do it. <laughs> That's a lot of stress. Damn. So, the problem with this guy, he can only move forward one. Huh? Jeez, that's so unlucky. Well, you can go ahead and transform. Yeah, he literally can't do anything. Oh! Alright. That sucked. Okay? That actually sucked. What are you gonna do? Heal yourself? I think he is gonna... Yeah, he's gonna heal himself. I swear, if he gets like a full... <laughs> this game hates me! Are you kidding me? That's the zero to like 28 heal. He got the 28. I... No. I... 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 I am a big re right now, yep. <sighs> of course he did. Of course he resisted! Dude, we are getting the most garbage RNG I've ever seen in my entire life. I can't believe it. I actually cannot believe how bad this RNG is. I swear, if he succeeds on this again. Are you kidding me right now? Okay, you know what? Sit there! You're useless! You useless animal dog monster thing! You get hit by a toothpick and you fall over like you're nothing! Holy crap! All right. Okay, that, that's, that's just great. I don't know what to do right now, man. I legit don't know what to do. <laughs> Can you, like, come here? Okay. To hell with this garbage, man. <laughs> I'm not cute! They're gonna start focusing the shield breaker soon, I'm sure. Yeah. Nice, thank you. Screw this guy and his god tier RNG. I'm gonna lose my mind. All right, my turn. Let's see. You know what? Okay. We need to do something. Start buffing dodge. See what we can do here. You want to be a butt? I'm gonna be a butt too. She's probably gonna do the stealth move if I had to take a guess. We have to stop that now. Yeah. Good. This positioning is horrible, though. I have to be real. Oh, I get first move? No, he gets first move.
What are you gonna do? I lowered their accuracy, right? No, I lowered their dodge. Hmm. What is it? Oh no. Let me guess, this is gonna work. Dude, I can't do anything right now. This is kind of depressing. Alright, um... Hmm, I could leave her there, actually. That poison is hurting, dude. Hmm. I want to spread out my targets a little bit. Go on, what are you going to do? I don't you! Yeah, they want to finish her off. It makes sense. Oh, that's unexpected. She's still alive. Oh, if I somehow win this, dude, then this is the most garbage player in, on Earth because I have had trash RNG in this encounter. Hmm. Now. Let me think. You're powered up. Yeah, I'm powered up. Thank you, thank you. Get her out of harm's way. I just wanted her to tank a hit for me. But she did. She can't easily be finished off now. Well, actually she can, depending on the move. Unnerved. Unbalanced. Cool. Oh my god. Alright, that's that's fine. What does he have? Oh, okay, he doesn't have much. He can okay, so we actually want to leave him in the back. We want to leave him in the back. You know what? One for one, bitch. Bring it! I'm so sorry, Zef. I'll do my best to keep you alive. He's, he's probably gonna go on a heal for a heal knowing him. Yeah, I swear if you get this game is so broken, dude! RNG sucks! That's all I can do. Oh my god! He's gotten crits galore! Yeah, I'm probably about to die here. He's gonna- she's gonna go for the kill. Oh, wait, no she isn't. God. This is infuriating. He should- his comp should not be working this well. The only reason why it's working this well is because he's getting insanely lucky. Insanely lucky. Okay. Nope. She's got one more block. That's not going to hold for much longer. Hmm. The reveling throne demands its portion. For the love of God, work! Dude! He's resisted twice in a row! I've unresisted twice in a row! This is depressing! He's going to do a... a if this works, I'm, I'm like uninstalling my game. Thank God! There is a God! Holy crap! Finally! Now I can actually play the video game. All right, my turn. Oh, Jesus, dude. <sighs> okay. All right, now, how do I want to play this out? I could de-stealth her. What is her move? Lunge. <gasps> Death blow chance. Oh, no, no, no. We have to do something. Jesus, they gave it too much. Well, dude, it's ridiculous! Oh, no. What can he... He's gonna go for the pool, isn't he? Oh, never, ever make, like, a, a ranked mode for this game, please. It just isn't going to work. This game cannot have, like, a ranked mode because the RNG ruins it. Abs... Oh, God. What's he gonna do? 
the RNG makes like a ranked mode for this game un impossible. You just can't. <laughs> Jesus, dude. Wait, is it my turn? No, no, it's his turn. I can't do anything. Wait, 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 wait. It is my turn. Oh, fuck. I wasn't ready. Woo! I didn't realize it was my turn. I thought it was his. Oh, because he still had to move. I'm an idiot. <gasps> that counts for the Caltrops? Oh, my. I mean, for the... Jesus, dude. Look at look at my characters right now. I should not be alive. <laughs> He's just getting obscenely lucky. Oh, Pog, here, guys. There's no other game. It's stupid, dude. Like RNG is trash. Oh, he really wants to finish my anti, doesn't he? Oh, thank God. At least I didn't get one knocked immediately. Zachary, you're going to be yelling every single turn's bad. Do you have to make Smolder agree? Yes. Yes, I am reading, all right. I can kill this guy next turn. Dude, we can actually maybe turn this around, which is crazy. He's going to probably go for it. Oh, he can't heal! He can't heal! He already is his cultist! He can't heal! He can't heal! Don't, you don't get a crit. I hate this stupid video game. You know what? Fuck you! No, 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 I'm taking something with me. If you win, you're not getting a flawless. Finish him. Fuck you! You got so much better orange than me and I still get the first kill. Get wrecked! Yeah! How you like that? Dude, three of my characters are about to die. Fuck. Honestly, he was useless anyway. <laughs> the enemy never gave me a chance to do it. Zap! Zap! Don't be hopeless! <laughs> there can be no hope in this hell. All right, it's fine. It's fine. We can still actually win this, believe it or not. It's not hopeless. Um, <laughs> no, it's okay. It's okay. We can do it. We can do it. We can do it. Uh, hmm. Think, think, think. The reveling throne demands portion. It's not impossible to win this. I think flash powder. I could ruin the accuracy of his. Uh... Such stress. No, I say dodge. We need to stay alive right now. Stack the dodge. It's true though. No! Bad! And improvement. Yeah, the corpse is bleeding. Fantastic. <laughs> Wait, when did he get full HP? Oh, he was never even hurt. Oh, great. Let me think. What do I want to do here? How much health do you have? 32? The reveling throng demands He's repeatedly um, going after my... Hmm. What? No, oh, God, you're not a masochist! Those it's 0% PU by default. What's 0%? Find it in no short supply. Yeah, breathe heavily. You better breathe heavily. Hmm. What are you gonna do? Come on, make your move. And how you doing, Tiger? Welcome, welcome. Shh. It's actually not that bad, even if that works. It's actually not that bad. In the pursuit of glory. Okay, we need to go for the kill now. No flame, no desire. You skipped your turn! Dude! Okay. At least he didn't move. The end approaches. Is she dying yet? Oh no, dude, she needs to be dying. 
Let me guess, you're gonna get an instant successful heal on the first go, right? He has gotten insanely good RNG heals every single time! I don't know what to do, dude! I legit don't know what to do. Oh, wait, you can't do that from here. That's what... Oh, my God. I don't know. I don't know what to do. <laughs> oh, you're not in the position that you actually made a mistake there. I wish I had 10% of this guy's RNG. I'm not backing out. It's not over yet. Come on. Don't crit again, I swear to God. All right. Well, we're all stressed now. Confusion. Come on, Arcane! Arcane! Stop being afraid! Come on! Ah! Okay. Hmm. We're gonna need to refresh this heal pretty soon. Well, let's start with dodge, actually. Nice. Good job cutting yourself. All right. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Make your move. Come on. Oh, I'm very scary. No! And of course, the dodge does nothing! Oh, she's going for the stress kill. Come on! This is so stupid, dude. I'm so salty right now. Oh! <laughs> This guy doesn't realize he could have killed my shield breaker long ago. He's actually, he's not playing well, which is why I'm still alive. Oh, get wrecked. Okay. Hmm, how do I want to play this? Nya, 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 salty. Can you do the heal from any position? He can. The reveling hmm. its portion. It's fine. It's okay. It's okay. Nya, 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 nya. That's so good. <laughs> That's not who I wanted you to hurt! We're gonna die from stress, dude. I can't control my characters now because they're all stressed. He got so many lucky CC, so many lucky crits, so many lucky. Give me another 20,000. Finally, an unlucky hill! They actually exist, dude! If I was able to control the shield breaker, I'd be able to kill this person, but we got unlucky, so I can't. Ah. Oh. Come on, let me make a move. You did two damage. You actually did two damage. You actually did two damage. You actually did two damage! What? This is bad. Capuchin the soul. Terrible vistas of emptiness reveal themselves. Shut up. Heal. Keep us off death's door. All right, who's who's left? Oh, it's it's their turn. Okay, come on, dude. That's really good. He made a mistake. Wait, he made a huge mistake. I can kill her. I can kill her. Oh, oh, oh. yeah, you better be hopeless. I'm gonna turn this around. This by this garbage RNG. I'm gonna win. Yes, 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 yes. Perhaps you need some comforting. I will give Draggy butt huggles and cuddles and nuzzles, as well as a nice pausey and garwu also. Nom nom riri 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 He died from a heart attack. Frick. It's okay, she served her final purpose. My turn. Now I'm taking blood too, bitch. Fuck you! We can still do this! And big isolation, thank you so much for the 20 minutes. I appreciate it. It means a lot to me. Oh, it's zero by default. You can't have a virtue. I see, I see. Come on, dude. Come on. He doesn't really have that much... Frick this game to hell, dude! Frick this game to hell! Okay. What do I do? Oh my god. He has one move that does damage, but it's only in those positions. I could potentially shuffle him if we stay alive long enough. I mean, he has how much health? Come on, come on. Okay. 
What can he do the pool positions to? He's keeping himself alive pretty well. Come on, dude. Come on, come on, come on. Hmm. What if I shuffle that guy to the front? Well, then he'll be able to... <gasps> he can do the sacrificial stab now. <gasps> no, we're afflicted. He's going to kill. We have to stop him. 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 What kind of CC do you have? You don't have any CC. I have to scare him. I have to scare him. Make him go for the heal. I, I don't care. Ah, oh, shit, dude. You're hitting so little, dude. Come on! This guy! I got so much good RNG! It's not looking good. I'm going to be real with you. Soaks the soil, feeding the evil. Yeah, that's not good. I don't have any more shields once he breaks it. That's my last shield. That's GG. Oh, wait, no, what? I have another one. Oh, he's been debuffing me, so I do little damage. Frick, man. Come on, Zah. You couldn't do one more damage. Just one. We're dead, dude. They are really, no, no, dude. Dude, dude, Iron! Don't even! Don't even! Yeah, because he keeps debuffing. Oh my god, I'm doing minus 66% damage. We've gotten trash RNG this. Like, I cannot believe it. The amount of crits he's like. Oh, he's just toying with me now. He wanted to max out my stress. You survived, barely. Surviving oh my god. Is a tenuous proposition. He's- we've gotten such garbage already. He put- my abomination basically could do nothing. Ah, oh, it's Chi-Chi. My abomination was basically useless that entire fight. He could do nothing. Literally nothing. The blood and collect the teeth. That RNG- and I even- Will here's the thing, dude. The no, shut up! He got lucky. He got insanely good RNG. Crits non-stop. Successful CC non-stop. That was BS. I am salty as hell about that fight. No, 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 no. Dude, my abomination could do literally nothing for like the entire fight. And like, dude, no, 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 no. Look at this. He has a trinket plus 30% move resist. My butt. He was getting moved like every time. And not only that, when I tried to do slam, it failed both times. It failed both times. And the enemy critted me repeatedly way more. I think I only got it like one crit on them, maybe two. I think just one. It was insanely bad. It was infuriating. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we need to make an anti-RNG comp a little bit. Let me think about this. But dude, he actually, he did not play well. We were actually kicking his ass despite how much good RNG he got. We almost won that fight, but yeah, then I just need to hang in there like one more turn. I would have had him. Ah, oh, well, GG. And the heals, dude, that was another thing. His cultist heals. Oh my God. It was like 20, 28, 28, like 28, 22. I think another 20-something, and then he landed like a 2, and then like a 14. His cultist heals were broken. He got so lucky on the cultist heals. And because I couldn't keep my abomination in the front, I couldn't provide pressure, and he was getting good RNG healing, good RNG CC, and I was getting bad RNG damage. Like, it was so bad. Like, it was depressing. <laughs> See, where I can pay a fight. Oh, I've, I've had my fair share of those. <laughs> I've had my fair share of those, Iron. It usually costs my heroes their life. Ah, I need to think about this more. Can I put a second, like, anti-CC RNG, uh, thing? What other trinkets are there? If there's another trinket I can put on that reduces CC chance, I want it. Let me see. Because that was so bad. Because I recognize that was a weakness in my comp. If my abomination gets pushed to the back, there's not much he can do. So that's why I put this here, so that it was very unlikely. Dear Lord, I'm, I'm, I'm impressed. My, my shield breaker can stand her ground, though. She did well. The bounty hunter was a really good finisher, but I really wonder if someone else can do the job better. Someone can put more on the table. I'm convinced the anti is really good. I like the anti -Korian. She's going to be my healer. I'm not going to use a cultist. I have trash RNG. It's not going to work in my favor. <laughs> it's going to be really, really bad. Well, I can get more stun resist. Stress resist. Yeah, I don't- I didn't- there's nothing- oh, well, here's stun- yeah, is there anything else that does movement resist? Maybe I need to unlock it later. I don't think I have any other movement resist trinkets, do I? No, I don't. So that's the most I can do. I can't do any better than this. Hmm. Maybe I just leave it as it is and just acknowledge that that was a horrible luck and will probably not happen again, because if my abomination was able to stay on the front line, dude, I could have shredded through his front line. His front line was weak. I could have raked them to death. And that's why I give him CC resistance, but, like, it's not enough. They still CC'd him so easily. Like, Jesus, man. Uh... 
If I didn't put an abomination... See, the problem is if I put a Hellion, here's the problem. She functions best when she's in position one, and the Shieldbreaker is going to keep pushing her out of position one, so that's why I don't really want to use her. We could run a Highwayman. Highwayman, I could run a Duelist Advance. And that wouldn't actually be a bad idea. We could, instead of Grape Shot, run this. Bypass Stealth. Minus 20 dodge. You get more damage, more accuracy, more crit. Ignore stealth. I could run a Highwayman instead of Abomination. The nice thing about a Highwayman is no matter what position he's in, he can do something. And since the uh, Aquarian is so good at moving... Yeah, I might run a Highwayman. A-Bomb just does so much damage, dude. He hits hard. I melted that first team with him. But it's like, what does it matter if I just keep getting ragdolled? And if, if, yeah, if the Highwayman ends in position 1, you can even point-blank shot, which hits really hard. And he's really good at finishing, too. Death blow chance, plus 20%, yeah. I don't really care for the bleed. Honestly, dots seem pretty weak if they can't finish you off. I don't think I'll ever do a dot build, but I might try a stress build. Grape shot blast, no. I might try to make room for Vendetta, I don't know. This is a must, this- no, maybe not. I don't know. Ah, mm, Shmoochie, I'm back. Dragon Dragon, but love you very much. And if I just wipe my browser cookies, no, no. Now you have to re-log into everything. I might I might rock a highway, man. That's actually not a bad idea. Um, I'm not really impressed with the Grave Digger. She doesn't seem that good. The guy, he lunged me, which it was great and all, but it takes setup. Like, you have to prepare for it. Um, but I'm considering a highway, man. I'm considering... I think that's it, really. Jester? The problem with the Jester, if I want to use Finale, which I don't even think we need it. So wait, when it says it bypasses Death's Door, does that mean that if I get someone to zero HP with this, it will kill them right away before even procking Death's Door? Or do I have to proc Death's Door first and it'll just like have a 100% chance of going through it once Death's Door is procced? Like, what does that mean? I have to fix all my FFC settings? Oh no. Is there, what do you do with the starting board? Do you mind to get better or for better weapons or good? Do you have to explore the world to get certain items? So... It's mixed. Um, I would explore the surface world, look around for chests to find better gear, because you find some nice things in chests. Um, but eventually, yeah, mine, mine for, like, if you see something easy within reach, mine it. Mine some tin, mine, mine some uh, iron, whatever you see. Um, but explore the surface, at least where you can. If you run into corruption, you die a lot, that's gonna make it rough. But look around for chests, and then, yeah, at some point you're gonna want to start digging, like, below your base straight down to make a elevator, because you will use that eventually. So, yeah, the only thing I don't like about Dirk Stab is the fact that it, um, it moves you forward, which, I mean, I don't really want the Jester at the front. What if I, like, kept spamming Dirk? Like, Dirk, he doesn't do much damage. 6 to 11. And, I mean, he could pop in, um, I'm never gonna use Inspiring Tune, dude. It's just not worth it. I wouldn't try to use that just to manage stress. But, I mean, it's pretty big, though. I mean, minus 20% stress and minus 30, that's huge. I don't think it's worth it, though. Uh, finale, buff self. You can pop this at the beginning to buff accuracy so we don't miss. Hmm. And then... I guess I would just spam Dirk Stab? Constantly? Wait, but you have to be in the back to use buff ballad, so I'd have to start him in the back, move forward. I don't know, man. I don't know about that. Finale. I'm not. F I. I don't know. I think the bounty hunter is more potential because the bounty hunter, and and the highwayman. The bounty hunter. What's really good about the bounty hunter? But yeah. Oh, by the way, Iron. Let me make it clear. That was that was the third match. I won two in a row. That was the third one. I beat the first guy. He rage quitted after I killed his first player. I, his first, I killed one of his guys. He rage quitted. The second guy like quit as soon as he saw me. Maybe like a disconnect. The third guy was just trash RNG. It was trash. Like I couldn't believe it. Which is why I'm considering replacing him with the Highwayman. Because the Highwayman, no matter where he is, he works. And if the if the bounty hunter gets pushed into where's the bounty hunter? Bounty Hunter, Bounty Hunter, where are you? Yeah, yeah. If he gets pushed into position two, he still works. Arguably, I could actually, like, use Uppercut in that case, because Uppercut is good, does knockback and daze when it works. 
Because, I mean, mark for death? Like, how often would I actually use this? Oh, but if I have a highwayman, he benefits. Yeah, plus 70% damage versus marked. That's right. So there's synergy now. In which case, I would consider using the hook instead of um, the flash ring. I just like that it lowers their dodge, too. Hmm. So base nine. It just does more damage versus marked. Let's try one more with the same exact comp, okay? And then if we run into the same problem, I'll, I'll swap Abomination for a Highwayman. Uh, I think you deserve to win that fight thing. I mean, dude, we were kind of, I'm not gonna lie, we outplayed the hell out of him. Even though the RNG was so bad, we outplayed the- I'm not a pleb! Peter! Bad! Go away, Peter! I'm not a pleb! I outplayed the heck out of him, even though I had bad RNG! Bad! I have to use my one with the third and potential fourth on the way? That's awesome, Kai. I can't wait to see them. Alright, it's time to kick some butt. Let's go. So, I'm thinking, yeah. I'm, I'm thinking I might swap the, um, I might swap the abomination for a highwayman. Sans my joy, get my- No, stay, please, here! Mm, but just bad. Oh, this is interesting. I get the first move. Okay. Um, we could focus the back line. I like the idea more of raking. Hmm. If I use rage, I could hit this guy. How much health? 31? Or I could start raking the front line. 43, 46. I don't know, their back line is pretty squishy. Hmm, but I could start raking and pressuring. It's not as much damage as I thought it would be. It'll buff up though, but we kind of have to sustain. Oh, I see what you're doing. Oh, I see what he's doing! He, oh shit, that's a dodge, I'm sorry. Family friendly, that's a dodge composition. He's gonna stack this guy's, oh Jesus, that's scary actually. I see exactly what he's doing. Hmm. I need to disorient his composition now. Of course it does that. I'm dropping the flashbang. I'm running hook. Flashbang, I'm getting I'm not getting what I want out of it. Dear lord, I'm not running flashbang anymore. That was that was a waste. That did absolutely nothing. What is he rocking? He's rocking Yeah, okay. He's gonna stress my back line. He's gonna use the dodge thing hundred percent. He's a dodge comp. Oh, that's not what I expected. He's going for repost. Okay. Hmm. Okay, let's try. <sighs> Damn it. I need to pressure his team. I should have I should have hit his uh whatchamacallit. That would have been better. Yeah, you know what? I should have done that. I wish I did rage instead of rake. That was a misplay. And he got so lucky with the shuffle. Play grenade. Okay, it's just gonna do a dot and it's gonna apply some stress. It's okay. Not a big deal. He's just gonna keep spamming it. Okay. Let's apply dodge. Flash powder could reduce accuracy. Hmm. Maybe I want to reduce the bounty hunter's accuracy so he can't CC me. Or just increase dodge, it's fine. Anyways, pass all going right now. No, 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 no. Here we go, it's all stream bad. No, 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 no. It's a family friendly stream. Oh, he's gonna go for the hook, huh? No, what's he going for? Caltrops. Oh, he wants to. So he's a, he's a dodger and a, and a dot stacker. Oh, I get it. I get it. You're a dodger and a dot stacker. Nasty. So maybe we need to stack some heals. Hmm. Yeah, he's gonna start. Yo, that repost hurts. I don't know if it's worth it. Well, let me think. Hmm. You're gonna start pressuring him, aren't you? There's a weakness in my composition. I see it now. 
Dude, yeah, he's all about like, yeah, he's a he's a dot stacker and a dodger. I get it. Okay. Hmm. This is not working too well. Do I try my luck with RNG again? I'm gonna try it. Don't bone me, dude. Don't don't bone me. Thank you. That's what I wanted. That's more like it. There we go. I'm gonna start running hook instead of a uh, flashbang. I think the bounty hunter is a good choice, but flashbang is just I'm not getting good RNG out of it. What is he going to do? He can only do he might do a hook. He's gonna do a hook probably. Yeah, he is. He got it. Okay. Now my options. Hmm. Does this do damage to mark target? It doesn't. Okay. I want to pressure him, dude. I want to scare him. Yo, you're not hitting that hard. I don't know. He's probably just going to move him if I had to take a guess. I don't think he'll go for the incision. Oh, he will go for the incision. A plague doctor can do that much? Yikes. This is not going well. He's actually he's actually kind of outplaying me here. I'm not even going to lie. He's kind of outplaying me here. I don't think he has a way to remove stealth, though. He, he's actually winning this fair and square, unlike the previous guy. This isn't about RNG. He's actually countering me pretty hard. But I'm learning. I'm learning about some weaknesses in my composition, and I'm, I'm going to adjust accordingly. Okay. Let me think. That repost is going to hurt. But I think it's worth it because the Plague Doctor's right here. Dude, why can't you do more damage? I feel like I'm getting the lower end of the spectrum here. Hmm. I don't know. Yeah, he's a dot comp. Uh, so I trying to get, yes, I am trying to get family friendly. Kind of rip me. I'm sorry, Kai. It's okay. They can't hit you right now. What's Rampart? I don't even know what that is. <gasps> oh, nice. Okay. Hmm. I mean, there's only one person I can move right now, so... I just feel weak. Why do I feel like I'm doing no damage? I don't get it, man. All right. Um, that wasn't what I was hoping for. I was hoping to finish, but that's not going to happen. Hmm. Yo, I didn't mean to do that. I realized I was running out of time. Oh my god. Frick. I was running out of time. Derp. <laughs> Damage over time. No! Yeah, this isn't looking good, dude. This actually is not looking good. I'm sorry, team. I failed you. <laughs> He's actually, his, 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 though to be fair, his dodge isn't helping him very much, but yeah. Maybe I confused him by doing that. He's like, why did I mark him? I meant to mark the Plague Doctor. That's not going to work. Yeah. Well, I mean, I didn't expect it to miss, but... Okay, you're actually going to need to pop a heal, because you need to get off Death's Door. Alright, make your move. But yeah, that was a misplay on my part. I swear, if you cannot do five damage next turn, you suck. The buffoon is flummoxed. The buffoon is flummoxed. Move, yeah, he's moving. All right, that's fine. My turn. Okay, thank you. He's on death's door now. And now the true test. Mm -hmm. See, if I had marked the plague doctor, my shield breaker could have potentially finished him next. What are you gonna do now? Rejuvenating but he's scared, he's stacking heal. Wait, did he just do that? That was a mistake. I'm gonna kill him. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles, baby. That's right. What are you gonna do now, bud? What's the matter? What's happening to your composition? Confidence is surging, baby! Confidence is surging! What are you gonna do? Confidence is so shh! Oh, thank God. <laughs> Confidence is surging, baby! What are you gonna do? Do they have any way to hurt me? You no, know, no, what do you have? He can't reach that target. Okay, good, good, good. So I can, I can ignore that right now. Confidence is surging! Hmm. Uh, 
Oh, he doesn't ever post anymore. Keep raking. Ooh. How about that for a dot, buddy? Not looking so hot. What are you gonna do? You're not gonna be able to outheal this very easily. He's probably gonna stack another heal. He's scared. <laughs> uh, wink. Yeah, I knew it. He was gonna stack another heal. No, 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 no. Poises aren't overconfident, but poises are smart. Okay. Let's scare him. You need to do 12 damage. You do 9 to 16 damage. Thank you! Good. At the very precipice of oblivion. Oh! Oh my god, that's a massive heal! He wants the stun. Oh wait, no, that's... Oh, he's, he's applying this. That's fine. Okay, you're gonna need a stealth again because he's gonna go for a kill on you. So go ahead and take cover one more time. He wants to finish you off. Don't give him that opportunity. Wait, but she could use flash. Oh, she didn't put a flash powder on. He didn't put flash powder on. That was a mistake. He didn't build correctly. That was a mistake. Sting vapors. Death waits. Oh. For the I know you need a healer. Oh wait, 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 wait. Oh, I didn't realize festering. Oh, it does damage. Oh, so we I actually got lucky, didn't I? Hmm. All right, all right. This is going to hurt. I could get my a bomb killed because of this. Hmm. Don't, don't do it yet. Do this then. Can you do 12 damage again? Thank you. All right, all right. Teetering on the brink, facing the abyss. What are you gonna do? Make your move. He made a mistake. He should have played as that guy, so he got a 12 heal. He made a mistake. He made a mistake. He made a mistake. You made a mistake. Oh shit! Maybe he didn't make a mistake. Can you still do finish him? Can you still do finish him? Please tell me you can still do finish him from here. Oh, yeah, no, you made a mistake. You made a mistake. You still made a mistake. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. What now, bud? Not looking so hot. What are you gonna do? Wait, it's my turn? Oh, it's my turn! Yeah, because I killed two of his guys, so I get more turns. That actually makes sense. Uh, who's left? I could play you or... Hmm. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to stack up more healing. <laughs> he had a good comp! And I, I had, I, I'm realizing some mistakes in my build. I'm going to fix them, but it, it's still looking pretty good. I get, oh, he gets first move. All right, what is he going to do? Come on, bud. What's your plan? What's your plan? Come on. No, no, poises aren't overconfident. I'm going to win this. No, 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 What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Ow. As life ebbs, all we have to do to save his life is play as him right now. That's all we have to do. All right, my turn. He gets the heal. All right, cool. So now he's no longer on death's door. All right, and hmm, what should I do here? From here, I could do... I could mark target. Or should I do damage? Do damage. Frick, I should have marked. All right, all right, all right, all right, fine, 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 fine. That's fine. What are you gonna do now? I mean, we're not looking super healthy. Like, I'm gonna be real. Like, this isn't super comforting. Oh, he critted someone. Oof, double death door. Hmm. He's stacking poisons. All right, well, I get a couple, I get a few turns before this guy can uh, do anything. So let's capitalize. Hmm. You have 50% rake damage bonus. Mine is 50 and rake 75% damage. Hmm. Oh, dude, no! Why is he getting good RNG now? This is not good. Hmm. This is actually not very good. 
All right, stack more heals. We need to sustain a little bit better. Free win? I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. He's dodging a lot. He's getting a little bit lucky right now. Okay. Um, hmm. Maybe I should have flash powered. I could have powdered, I mean. Hmm. Whose should I focus more? I don't know. Tough call. I also played my characters out of order if I wanted to reposition them. Shoot, I might actually lose my bounty hunter here. Fuck, I am gonna lose him. Whoa! I didn't! I got lucky! Yo! I'm not gonna lie, that was actually really good RNG. I got lucky. Okay, play him so that he doesn't die. Wait, why didn't you get the heal? What? Why didn't you get the heal? That was weird. Okay, then. Well, if he's about to die, I need to make sure I can confirm kills. So... What does your mark do? Okay, we need, we need to mark because I may I may lose him. I need to be able to confirm kills. Okay. Because he's my finisher, so put a mark target on him. This is not as comfortable as I would like. Oh, he might, she might, he might die from Festering Vapors here. I don't know why this heal didn't proc. Whatever, he might die from this. He's gonna, she's gonna do Festering Vapors again. Oh boy, that was actually 4 feet of the chest. Yo, I'm not gonna lie. I'm getting really good RNG on that death store right now. I'm actually getting really good RNG on that death store right now. Okay, now we do damage. Um, do it in a different order though. Do it like this. That's more like it. Thank you. Inspiration. Yeah. And improvement. And then um, yeah, we still we still have more moves. RNG. Yeah, yeah. I need all the RNG. Stack more healing. Keep my teammates alive. We get we get more bonuses if it's a flawless. Let's make it flawless, baby. All right. I should still get my move. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh no. Selfish. What are you gonna do? Selfish. At any cost. You son of a. Hmm. We can't. Oh, you could use it again, but. Shit. Well, that's unfortunate. He got very lucky there. All right. Well, let's see what happens. Come on, come on. He's gonna try to finish him again. I'm sure. Ah! He's probably dead here. Yo! <laughs> Can you imagine how furious this guy is right now? Okay, please heal this time. Okay, thank you. I did that. I gave up the potential, like, death blow. Okay, Mark. How much longer is Mark? Three rounds? Okay. Mark this one, too. I want these guys to be easier to kill later. All right. Good, good. Now he can't be finished right away, lol. Dude, I'm not gonna lie. The, 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 yeah, the game is compensating for the previous match. Now, he can't kill me. He can't kill me now, it's hilarious. Okay. Okay, well, I mean, now we get three free moves. Yo, nice crit heal. Let's stack this healing up some more. Okay. My turn again. Let me go. He should be on death's door now. Okay. Injury and All right. That was close, dude. That was really close. Let me make my move. I was here first. You stupid. Well, he's. I mean, I'm getting pretty bad RNG with the uh, abomination, but uh, otherwise, yeah. The birthplace of dread. Okay. He gets first move. What are you going to do? Oh, God, they're with you today. Well, for this round, not the previous one. Big like sunshine. Oh, thank you. She went for the heal. Okay, finish this guy. He's going to be so salty if I get this finish on the first try. <laughs> Can you imagine how salty he is right now? Can you imagine? Can you imagine? He tried to finish this guy like four or five times. He couldn't. I finished him on the first try. <laughs> He surrendered! He's like, I'm gone! He rage quitted, he's gone! He's gone, he's had enough, he's gone! <laughs> That's tough match, it was tough. It was tough, GG, we got it. We got it. I feel, a, I feel a little bad too, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> no, it was kinda like you last match, it was. It was. It was kinda like me last match, I'm not gonna lie. Turn to circus. I'm not bad! Nice, thank you, thank you.
<sighs> okay, first off, give up the stupid... Where is it? Where is it? Yeah, none of this. Give me this instead. Thank you. Abomination, we need to talk, buddy. I... Hmm. I don't know. I feel like you leave a lot to be desired, my friend. Oh, all our Zelda's favorite dragon, that's right. That's right. Ooh, big guy, sorry, I love you too. Let me drink some water, we're so worked up there. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm gonna try the highway, man. Well, hmm. The thing is, I really like A Bomb when he works. Rake felt really underwhelming. I, it felt weak. It felt really, really weak, so maybe we'll just go straight to Rage then. Rage hits hard. It hits really, really hard. I'm gonna try one more with A-Bomb, and then I think I'll go Highway Man. I just wanna- I wanna do this hook instead of the Flash Bang. Let's try again. Uh, Flag in first. Hellion in second. Jester in third. Arbalist in fourth. Flagellant? Flagellant's a pain in the butt because he won't die. He has high death blow resistance. And plus, if you focus him, it's really punishing because he has Exsanguinate and he has, uh, where's the other one? Redeem. These are, like, really, really good. Oh, what's this? Clear mark target. He marks himself. He takes less stress and 10% death blow resist. He's a pain to kill. Hellion in second, but wouldn't you want Hellion in first for, um... Iron Swan. Hellion does have some really cool stuff though, like reducing accuracy. This is nice. And, and inflicting stress. Boop, 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 boop. Not to mention, um, yeah, she if you reposition her, she can come back, no problem. This is insane. Clear debuffs, cure blight bleed, and heal 4 HP, and get more accuracy and 30% more. That is crazy. That is actually crazy. And then bleed out. I find it kind of weird that dots don't go through death's door. I feel like that makes dots very, very weak. I feel like dots are very weak. If they if they updated the game and made dots go through death door, then I'd have to start respecting them. Because right now people stack the bleeds on poisons on me, and I don't really care that much. <laughs> like I, I I just kind of ignore it, especially since regen ha happens to everybody and everybody's affected. So, okay. And then you like the I didn't I didn't really feel like the archer is like amazing, but I don't know. Teach their own. And what was the other one? Jester in third. Jester, dude, the the oh oh. So Kuvro, you probably know this. I have a question for you. Finale. Does it? If you hit someone with finale, but they're not at death's door yet, can it still kill them, or do you have to be at death's door, but it one shots them through the death's door? Viewer PVP? No, nah, not right now. Uh, oh man, my current order. If you encounter me in like the the queue, by all means, but not not no, not viewer PVP. Maybe like some regulars. Like if like some regulars want to buy. I mean, I don't know. It's hard to say. But right now, I'm just playing queue. Thought I'd be understanding. He gets buffed at death store instead of debuffs. Yeah. Now I use her as a starting move with breakthrough. Doesn't breakthrough weaken you though? I mean, it hits three people, which is great at half damage though. But you lose ten percent damage, and you get dazed. Well, I guess that's okay if you want to wait till the end. But yeah, I feel you. I feel you. You have to get them to death door before. Okay, gotcha. Your eyelashes are really short. I thought they're really long. Most people tell me. Or no, it's my eyebrows are like really. Th I thought my eyelashes are long. No. I don't know. Final kill only on death's door. Got it, got it. Okay. I'm liking this comp, though. I'm liking this comp. I might, uh... You know, I'm actually starting to realize something. Do you even really need... Yeah, you kind of do need a heal. This this does take me off death's door sometimes, which is nice. I might adjust this a bit. I don't actually know if buffing dodge is really worth it. This is a must. This is amazing. Flash powder is good for de-stealthing. I may actually run, because I noticed when that person was running Festering Vapors, it was really pressuring me, because um, it hits everybody, and I mean, you know, you could, you could potentially kill someone on death's door, it's scary, you know? Nervous Stab hits one person. This does, this does a lot less damage, but honestly, she doesn't do much damage to begin with anyway, as long as you're doing at least one damage. That's a chance of proccing death door. So I may actually try Festering Vapors. It seems like a good move. Nervous Stab, I don't know. I guess if someone was really close to death store and I wanted her to like inch them forward and then try to finish it with bounty or it would work, but eh. I like that he yeah, we could something you can only hit the front too. But yeah, if you had this then then yeah, you could uh you can hit the back line. And point blank shot is really good too. It gives options, you know? It gives me a lot of options. And then the repost is just more DPS. 
Anyways, I said one more time, one more with this comp, and then I would swap to Highwayman, right? Let's go. The ring first turn dodge. Take Doge, counter. it's best. First turn dodge. Wait. First turn dodge? Eh. I don't know. It's RNG, dude. Huh? Why, huh? Wait, what do you mean, huh? Three Crusaders and Battle Vest. Oh, you can stack more of the same? That's funny. Beat you to it. Why are you hauling at Garth? I think that's kind of mean. Wait, I don't understand. I'm sorry, your eyelashes are fabulous. Why, thank you. I appreciate it. Your eyelashes are quite long, though. That's not true. What's not true? Probably join out eyes in order to one that looks horrible at times. Oh, it's stressful. What's not true? I forgot to agree. What was I saying? All right. Oh, interesting. Wait, is this a battle vest? All right, I got first move. Why is the man at arms in the back? Interesting. Mace bash, she can daze. Hand of light. The reveling throne demands its portion. Hmm. So I'm not going to use Rake this time. Even the you have 37, 29. Hmm. She's going to... Wait, she doesn't have the stealth move? She doesn't have the stealth move. She doesn't have the stealth move. I'm going to exploit this. <laughs> doesn't stop their instant kill. Ah, okay. Bypass Death Star doesn't stop the instant kill. Wait. Can you explain? I don't actually understand. Does one hit kill if it does enough damage? Doesn't matter. I brought puncture. But you didn't see that coming, huh? <laughs> they have 50 HP, that's a 60 day. Oh! So so finale does kill them if 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 so they don't it does it doesn't have to get them to death store from the beginning. She's going for the heal, dude. She's scared. She has to. Yeah, yeah, she's going for the heal. Hmm. What's my next move? I pushed her out of position for her front two moves, though. Act now. Hmm, I could try to do some damage, or I could mark her to make it easier for my team to finish. I'm gonna pressure. Wait. We use it wisely because you don't want to kill. If you don't kill, it's wasted. That makes sense. Your eyes are set on the mind. No! Or your eyes are. I love you, Iron. I appreciate it. Dude, this guy is probably scared. <laughs> or they. <laughs> I just destroyed. He's probably really questioning his composition right now. Why does nobody use it? He's trying. He's trying so hard to keep her alive. I feel pretty bad. I'm not gonna lie. You're not giving up. Well, that's great. I'm happy for you. I'm really, really happy for you. Um. I'm so happy for you that you're not giving up. Believe me, I'm, I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy for you. <laughs> I'm so happy for you that you're not giving up. <laughs> I'm so happy for you, dude. <laughs> Oh my god. I'm gonna eat those words later. I know I am. Huh, what do I want to do now? I could pressure the Vestal. Yeah, because, I mean, when this happens, she's, she's gonna go into Death's Door, so I'm still forcing a move. This guy's gonna start running abominations after this. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna be like, that's so broken, dude! What is that character? Oh, he made a mistake. He made a mistake. He sh I, I, that was the dumbest thing he could have done. She doesn't have a heal, does she? Nope, he, he made a mistake. Well, he could try protect me again, actually. He could do that. Yeah, he's doing it again. Hmm. There are a few things I could do here. I could go for the direct finish, or... I could do the AoE move. Yeah, try Festering Vapors again. This bypasses. A decisive pummeling. Oh, okay. She dodged it, I think. Okay, okay. Here's all the flags that can be the ultimate battle. I can still destroy them. It's true. It's pretty sad. I'm gonna play! I'm gonna play! I'm gonna play! Oh, God. He's, he's, I'm putting him on the defensive, dude. He can't do anything. He hasn't touched me yet. He should probably go for, like, a stun or something. What does he have? Yeah, he is going for a stun. Let's see if he gets it. 
I gave him resistant. Nope, he didn't get it. Rip. <laughs> hmm. What are you gonna do now? Uh oh. Teetering on the brink. <laughs> See, he went for a tanky comp. He went for a tanky comp, but the thing is, I'm anti tank, so it's not gonna work. He went for a tanky composition. Yeah, yeah, true. By all means. Nice heal. Nice heal. Very good heal. Alright. Hmm. How do I want to play this? Yeah, I'm powered up. Alright, I want to go for a kill on something. What do. Wait, no, no. I want to read her moves. I can't right now. I'm going to mark someone for death. Mark. You. Well, you know who I want. <laughs> you know who I want. You know who I want. I'm coming for it. I'm coming for it. What are you going to do? Oh, that's cute. That's cute. You want to see what's going to happen next turn? That's so cute. You, you want to see what's going to happen next turn, buddy? Puncture. Oh, you survived. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Can I be guarded? <laughs> what are you going to do? What are you going to do? <laughs> His comp sucks. It does. It, I mean, I get what he was going for. But like it, there's, I have counters to it. <laughs> Poor thing. What are you gonna do? Okay. Uh, that's not what I would have anticipated. Hmm. What do I want to do though? I actually don't even know what I want to do. Well, in one move, I could do. Yeah, let's do festering vapors. Oh, I dodged. Dang. I really wanted to. Uh, huh. Okay. I kind of really want to use A-Bomb now, that pressure it feels like bullying. Well, it, like, I want to do things, but they're not making it easy for me. Bello, what does that even do? Weaken. Oh, jeez, that's a pretty significant debuff, actually. Mm. I guess I could mark the other one, just to make them easier to kill. For the whole team. <laughs> oh, man, I was honestly trash. He, he never really felt that good in single. I mean, he, th 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 here's the thing, right? Like, he gives some cool buffs, but my RNG is so bad, it never feels like they actually work. Like, I would stack dodge, and it felt like I didn't do anything. And I was getting depressed. <laughs> Migrating vapors. Yeah, 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 yeah. Stack up your dodge, buddy. We're going to have some fun. So, I think I'm going to start raking. Yeah. Oh, he just beats him every time? Nice, nice. I believe it. I believe it. I don't like this damage debuff. What are you gonna do? You're marked. She has to pop a heal, right? <laughs> I mean, what, what else can you do? Wait, she can't heal? Can't <gasps> she can't heal! Oh, you are so dead, woman. She's marked and finish him and the trinket. I'm so sorry. Disadvantage. Give them no quarter. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> Poor thing, dude. No, no, it's not bullying, boys. He's your pro. They earned it. <laughs> no, 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 no. Hi, man. Yeah, dude. I actually, I'm thinking about wait, replacing my uh, my abomination with the high. I mean, I bursted this guy's characters, which was pretty nice. But like, highwayman, like the reposting, like you have so much versatility with him. Smite. What does smite do? Yeesh! Ow. Well, there you go. You got some good RNG. <laughs> that hurt. Ow. Uh, hmm. She doesn't have a heal, does she? She doesn't. So, I mean... Yeah, she's in trouble. Uh, okay. Maybe, maybe... Hmm. I want a flawless victory so I get more points. But I feel like the best way to do it is to, like, kill him before he can do anything. If it gets bad, then I can, uh, I can do something else. Well, no, but can this guy reach me? Oh, make your move, make your move. Oh, dude, I'm hitting nothing. They're dodging. Okay, stop stop using that. It's not working. Does it have a really bad accuracy or something? 90, that's not very high. Yeah. She might try Festering Vapors. Yeah, I really wanted it so they would knock her to death's door. One HP is so much higher than zero. <laughs> that's such a weird thing to say, but it's true. Yeah, I knew it. He was going to do that. Damn it. 
Yeah, maybe I should have gone for the heal, actually. Hmm. This could be bad. Make sure that she can't be guarded. Okay. So that she he can't save her. Yeah, he's nuts. Nice. Small dude's what a boy! If he won't die, he's a DPS beast damn. Press the badge, give it a quarter. Ah, he can't do damage, so I'm gonna go for the kill. That doesn't do damage. Does he have the lance move? He doesn't. He doesn't. So he his enemy. Oh shoot! Jump in! Don't let me down! Oh, isn't that the worst one in the game? You're gonna kill yourself. Okay. You can't. Hmm. Well, there's an advantage. I could heal you. Hmm. Yeah, I want my flawless. I'm gonna heal you. I'm gonna heal him. I want to get my flawless so I get more points. Alright, he gets his move. What is he gonna do? He's probably gonna move that character, but it won't matter. He can't be guarded, so we'll be fine. Make your move, bud. It's your turn. He's just gonna move up, I guess, or he's gonna go for the heal. Dang it, stop! <laughs> oh! You lucky. Hmm. Well, huh. I was gonna use someone else to do damage, but she is marked. He's the only one that gets a damage bonus off the mark. Or I could, I could try my luck with Shieldbreaker, but you know... Wait, she has 60 dodge right now? Oh my lord. I'm gonna do it. Just do it. Nah, frick. That dodge. It's pretty high. Never nyamshish. She's probably gonna move back. It's the smartest move she could do right now so that the Crusader can actually do something. No. That was very unexpected. Why, though? Yeah, it's not enough damage. That guy got an insanely... I mean, you know, I, I would say this fight's been pretty balanced and fair overall, so yeah. How much... Oh, okay, only one round. Nyomchis! Never ever Nyomchis! Dude, this is taking too long, man! Oh, I should have used the other move! Annoying! All right, let's put a heal. I don't want to risk something going bad. I mean, I could do the poison, but it's probably going to miss. Just do the heal. It's more reliable to land. All right, I get one more move. Hmm. Oh, yeah, that provides horror, so I might actually stress her. Hmm. Okay. Wait, actually, I shouldn't have done that, because, yeah, yeah, yeah. Also, I forgot that she was guarded. I completely forgot. But what would I have done instead if she was? I don't know. I would have probably hit that guy directly with a rage. Hmm. <laughs> Gosh, just die, dude! You're gonna lose! You're delaying the inevitable! Oh, my lord! Just die! <laughs> You were- you were actually delaying the inevitable, man. Just die, dude! <laughs> he really is, he really is, dude. He's gonna die, it's only a matter of time. How much stress do you have? You li 99! You're literally 99. You really want this person to miss his attacks, huh? Okay. Suit yourself. Alright, I may as well keep, uh, charging right- rake. Oh, that was a mistake, cause now that guy's there. What's gonna happen with the Antiquarian? Paranoid, okay. The walls closed Do you seek my gold? Come and get it. Conspiracy. What are you gonna do? What can you do now that you're here? Huh, not much really. Yeah, that's all you could do. <laughs> but he's stressing out my team. Yeah, now you're stressed. Actually, if I don't kill fast enough, he will get to me through stress. He will actually get to me through stress. This is kind of scary. We need to wrap this up, dude. Oh, never mind, that worked. Oh, he gave up! Finally! Thank you, dude! Holy hell! <laughs> Can't outrun fate, yeah. It's taking way too long. GG! Sick him? Yeah. Thank you.
Let's try Highwayman. Let's give Highwayman a go. And word travels. Let it not precede collapse. Antiquarian. Oh, oh, shoot. That's good. Yo, yo, I actually wasn't paying attention to the trinkets I was getting. What have I been getting? Let me take a look at what we have. These fights? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to try Highwayman. I mean, I'm not going to lie. Abomination shined pretty well there, but I want to try some Highwayman. So, um, put this back. Damage and accuracy, stun move, resist. Got it. Sword by class? What did I find? That's, no. Oh, you're not, okay, well, I'll just read through them, that's fine. Oh, I have two of these now, can you stack two of the same? No, you can't, you can't. Uh, stun move, resist, yep, yep. Uh, damage, damage, accuracy, damage, mana, skills, crit, stress, stun, resist, dodge. Light, protection, stress, stress, damage, melee, protection, debuff, ignore still. Wait, where's the antiquarian item? I don't see it. What? Oh, here we go. It only shows if you have that character equipped. I don't like that. All right. Healing skills is good. Plus healing received? Nah. I would say this is way better. More HP, more dodge. Let's just take him. That's really nice. So, hang on. Let's click on all the characters. See. Oh, 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 what's this? Whoa, whoa, whoa. More accuracy, more bleed chance. Eh. What's this? Blight skill chance. That's actually good, but I don't, I don't really think blighting is really that great. But for him, that's good. More damage, more crit. That's really good. But I don't want to use a leper. Okay, that's it. Cool. We're gonna try Highwayman instead. So let's say the battle rage is on. Yes, he didn't surrender. If the game says opponent, that means both players won because there's a bug in the game introduced when they tried to fix game crashes. Wait, what happened? Both players won because there's a bug and they tried to fix. Oh, so he got lucky. He got a win too. Dang it. <laughs> Thanks for the heads up though. Hey, sissy, how's it going? I'm checking out the PvP update for the first time. We've been doing a few matches. I think I've got time for like one more. All right, this one's going to be draggy. I was the highway man in uh, the beginning. Actually, Rappy, you should have been one of these things too, but he didn't say anything. Well, you gotta get the the bad luck stream thing. <laughs> it was mixed there. There was only one fight that was really bad. The others were like okay, but yeah, sure they pile. Have a good one. But there's what he's the best catcher. I yo, I earned that victory. All right, what do I want you to have? Dude, you even have decent dodge. That's awesome. So I want you to have more damage, of course. Where is uh? No, 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 no. no, no. Dude, no. How? Okay. Well, actually, no. That is what I want. I'm, I'm a derp. No, I, I like the menu more when it's like from... It's the same thing. Oh, because he's on the far left. That's why it's confusing me. Most of my characters are on the right. Okay, okay, okay. Got it, got it, got it. I'm being a derp. All right. More damage and accuracy is always nice. No. No. By the way, I feel like this is organized really well. I like how they organize this menu. It's well done. It makes it super easy to pick what you want. Melee. Well, I don't want to commit to melee because he d he'll use the gun too, like point blank shot, for example. Hmm. Kind of don't want to get CC'd. Plus 10% damage when acting first, but you lose accuracy. But you gain accuracy here. Hmm. Don't you get a damage? Yeah, you lose 20% damage on this. Debuff chance, ignore stealth. Oh, I came with the 130 bits. I found something on my <laughs> Here, you can have Big X Arcane. I love you so much. Thank you for the 130 bits. All the hype at Chap Arcade Channel Plaza 130 bit donation. I appreciate it. means a lot to me. I love you very, very much. Thank you so much, our friend. Oh, and I need to catch up with Lay. I was so stressed out at the time. I forgot to read Lations. Perhaps Eastern Company, I'll give Dragon Butt Huggles and Cuddles and Nuzzles. Ah, mm, mm, cuddle and Nuzzle. As well as nice poison. No, 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 ordinary non gasmic poison. No, I'm never reading. I don't know if you're still here, Lation, but thanks, man. Sorry, I forgot to catch up with that because I was so worked up. Thank you so much for the 20 bits at Arcade. Thank you for the 130. I appreciate you both very, very much. All the hype in chat means a lot to me. Are you doing this again? Yeah, we even get a good show. Oh, you mean I might stream this again? I don't know. Would you want to see it again? He's much more stable than that. People have to see each other have heart attacks. So even when losing, just keep playing. Most likely to get free points. Gotcha, gotcha. You'd like to see it again? Maybe I'll do it again. 
Maybe I'll make some guides on this game. Because I actually, like, I played through the campaign a lot. Like, I mean, yeah, they changed stuff, but it's effectively still pretty much the same game. So, yeah, I need this finisher. I need the gun if I want to, like, shoot it. And my bounty hunter can mark the target. Point blank shot when I get to the front for, like, more damage and higher death blow chance. And duelist advance, yeah. So that's pretty good. Plus, he gets the damage bonus when acting first. It's really hard. Dude, that damage, I forgot I had that on my, uh, my, uh, whatchamacallit? My, um, uh, wait, but if, if stun, wait, stun doesn't make it so you can't move, though. Stun just makes it so that you move last. It's not that bad. The movement is not really the end of the world, considering you can always just move forward again. No problem. All of my characters can move just fine, except maybe the bounty hunter. So the bounty hunter will kind of just do his thing while everybody else repositions around him. But everybody else can move just fine. So arguably move resist is not that bad and stun is not really that bad either So maybe maybe give up the exotic snuff actually Because I don't mind getting moved too much. It's not a big deal. This is a very heavily moving comp if that makes sense Maybe I'll get I know the 10% is tempting, but he initiates with the duelist advance anyway, so it doesn't matter I would rather have something that does more damage Pit fighters I make him tank here. I don't know Stress taken. No, 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 no. Uh, where's... Yeah, like, maybe this one. More damage on the melee skills and more crit. I think that's better for him. But if I run Abomination, definitely, yeah, the movement one. Although, again, we're at the mercy of RNG, so you never know. <laughs> you never know, man. All right, let's try this. So he's he's gonna... 8 to 16. And you are... Where are you? 10 to 18. But he gets repost and he gets a uh, point-blank shot, which is nice. We're getting so much value out of Puncture. Expose I don't use very often, but I mean, it's there. If I gave that up, well, I mean, Impale, the nice thing about Impale... We could, like, alternate. Like, you use Impale, which puts the Highwayman at the front, and then the Highwayman uses, like, Point Blank Shot. But why, though? I mean, it does 30% more damage. You apply the poison. Eh, it's not worth it. I'd rather you pressure the squishies, because you can hit, like, everything. Yep. Let's try this composition out. I'm ready. My Sarajia should use the buff. What buff? Twitch is being super buggy. What's wrong? What buff do you mean, Diagi? Or Di Di Diagi? Diagi? Re? I may play this again. I may stream it again. Because for those who don't know, the stream ends in eight minutes. This is probably the final fight. Highwayman buff skill. Oh, with the the shot. Hmm. Maybe. I'd have to give something up though. There's not really anything I want to give up. Except maybe. Uh, I could maybe give up the pistol shot. I don't know. Hello? Yeah, Arcane, I see your chat. Do you not see me? And I'm an empowering dragon. Thank you, Aaron. Dragon, 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 Oh, hey. First time I've seen one of these guys. Let's see who goes first. His squishies are in the back. His tank ears are up front. Got it. He goes first. All right, fine. Go. The contest begins. Why don't I see any shield breakers? Like, nobody uses them. They seem really good. My shield breaker is awesome. Caltrops. Okay. Interesting. I don't really care. I am enjoying it. I am enjoying it. That was a mistake, bud. You shouldn't have done that. He's clearly a very dot-focused build. That that much is obvious. Let's pressure this guy already. He's already at death's door. Perched at the very precipice. Uh oh, what are you gonna do now? Does he have the po oh he does have battlefield medicine? He's probably gonna use that. That's not what I expected. Really? Diminished. Okay. Suit yourself. Suit yourself, buddy. Press this <laughs> advantage. Give An achievement, no one and done. Huh? Oh no, what's happening? The guy's dumb. Yeah. <laughs> I don't really know what he's going for. Brain dead stress flare. Oh. <laughs> kind of just let his guy die. Blinding gas. What does that do? Oh, less damage. Oh, no, the damage or something is less accuracy. Um, hmm. I want a flawless. We're doing pretty good. I say... Let's pop, pop the heel. I want to get all my points. Poor doggo. Oh, the dog's still alive. It's the guy that's not alive. Wait, is, is the dog actually... It looks like the dog's fine. He's, like, sad. I don't know. I never actually noticed that. He's really wanting to debuff my damage, huh? Minus 40% damage? Kind of hurts, I'm not gonna lie. 
Hmm. Pulls two. Your accuracy is minus 20, though. You might miss this. Nope. Nice. What do you have in that position? You can only do finish him? Oh shoot. Let's see if he gets it too. He got it. I might ignore it though. I might ignore it. No, no, I need to I need to address it because my bounty hunter can't really do anything back there. Well, hmm. I could move my antiquarian back immediately. That's a defensive play, or Because he's marked. I wonder if still the melee might have done more damage, though. What can you do from here? You can only do Disorienting Blast. A daze. Dude, you're not even, like, trying to protect your characters. Hmm. That's fine. He can do, uh, Duelist Advance. Yo! Oh, yeah, you're right. It is a stress build. Arcane, why are you scared? Hey, right, that's why you're Darkest Dungeon is so good. It is pretty good. Yo, yeah, it is a pretty stress-heavy comp. Oh, it's my turn. What am I doing? Um... I'd say this is a good time to move you back. Get you back here. Don't be scared, okay? She's just, yeah, it's pretty bad. <laughs> oh yeah, I get a turn again because, yeah. Is he... Yep, zero. Death's door. Uh-oh. I need to try a stress build one day. It looks like it's pretty fun. Just watching your enemy freak out. It's kind of like, it's, it's like a... What's the word I'm looking for? Dude, are you just gonna keep doing that? Or does stack a lot of stress? Hmm. I wonder if, it, if you play a stress... Oh, I can't finish just yet. Hmm. Damn it. Well, he's marked. Wicked Slice. Yeah, yeah, you could probably do it. Play this guy. I have two guys that can finish decently now. Ah, oh, damn it. You got lucky. That's fair. I mean, I've, I've gotten pretty good RNG here. All right, all right. Okay, the player is awful. Rip. It's hard to win with stress builds from Draggy. Yes, Arcane, I see you. Arcane, can you hear me? All right, he's moving him around. <laughs> uh, we could try... Pestering, maybe? I'm, I'm gonna let him go for the finish when he gets it. Alright, what is he gonna do? What can you do? You're probably gonna heal yourself. No? Very strange. Okay. Um, I'm gonna let the other guy go for the finish. Uh, you... What can you do? Who is... who's Squish here? Okay. Whoa, that bellow. Dude, minus 60% damage? Yo, this is actually kind of scary. Shit! Dude, I might actually lose this. I know it looks like I'm winning, but I'm actually... This is not good. I could actually lose. I actually just realized that I could lose this. There's no way you could lose? I don't know. I'm eventually going to lose control over my characters. And depending on how bad the RNG is... Please, you need to die. Oh, you can't reach him anymore. Like, we're doing no damage right now because of this guy's debuffs. This is actually really annoying. Homie win? I, I actually could lose. I could lose this. We had to burst him down faster. I'm having trouble finishing. Oh, God. Come on. Let me play him. All right. Finish, please. Okay. Alright, we actually crumbles. need to- we're, we're focusing the wrong guy. We need to focus this guy. He's- he's bad. He's- he's hurting me, like, a lot. Maybe I need to consider dots, dude. I don't know. Okay. No, 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 no. Hmm. Let's think through our next moves carefully. Um, so you- we have this, we have this. I could back you up. Because Arcane can't really do anything from there. Yeah, I think I'm gonna back you up. You're not doing a whole lot from where you are. 
He can do it there. Ooh, all right, Zilly got this now. I hope so, dude. He's gonna give everybody heart attacks. Like, this is actually kind of scary. Ah, oh, man. Minus 80% damage? Yo! This is ridiculous. This is actually kind of bad. I do no damage now. I'm gonna need to consider putting some dots in my build in case I see weird things like this. This is actually pretty bad. Bro, thank you, Poppin. Yo! This is like a very late game build, and even though I've killed half his team, I do like no damage now. Shoot. Dots damage over time. Yeah, that inflict. Shoot. And that doesn't proc the repost because, uh. Come on, oh yeah, it's not gonna work right. It's selfish. I mean, it's weird. Is everyone in the meta right now, really? Yeesh. Oh, and then Zef stress too. This is where it starts to get bad. This is where it starts to get really bad. He can't heal though. Wait, what? Oh, maybe that's what you're talking about. It bugged. A cacophony of bloodthirsty delight. Praise well earned. So I guess he got a win too, right? Dude, I actually don't know how that would have ended up. He might have won or I might have won. It could have gone either way. I honestly think that could have gone either way. Man at arms only, more accuracy, more crit, plus 20% debuff skill chance. Jeesh. On attack, crit, buff, party, all accuracy? Wow. Healing skills. Brawler pull. I don't know. All right, all right. Silver syringe. Let me put that on my antiquarian real quick. I need to think about that build. I didn't have enough. Dude, that debuff was brutal. I say you could have won. I think you totally had that game. You might have been right. You might have been right, but it was it was kind of getting scary. And depending on how bad the afflictions behaved, it, it could have been really nasty. Um, Antiquarian, Antiquarian, where are you? No, no, no. You. Oh, you already have that. Okay. So, here's the problem. Ideally, you would burst a comp like that before they could burst you down. Ideally. Um... Or I need to put some dots, like maybe apply this bleed. Uh, if I put a bleed... Which of these guys can apply dots? You can apply... I don't really have room for this, though. If she gets pressured, I use Serpent Sway. This is for the de-stealth thing, but I know my Antiquarian is at Flash Powder. I guess my Antiquarian should have spammed Poison. That's what, she sh what should have happened. I should have actually done that really early on. I should have used an Antiquarian to spam Poison. She, she has a dot. I could have spammed Festering Vapors. It's not a strong poison, but it's, it's something. Um, and maybe I want to consider squeezing a bleed on you. But what if I ever want to hit... I mean, the only thing I could give up for it... I wouldn't give up Wicked Slice because... Well, actually... Hmm. Well, you can't use this in position one. So, so... Duelist advance until you get to position one and then point blank shot? Yeah. And then what of these? Pistol shot is good if I really want to finish something in the back, but he is built for melee. So maybe bring a bleed just in case we end up in a situation like that again. Because normally I think, oh, you know, I don't, I think about damage mitigation as like armor. It's like, that's fine. She pierces it. But I was actually dealing with dots. That was pretty nasty. I mean, uh, with, with, with uh, debuffs. And none of these people have a way to cure debuffs. I guess Kuvro's Helion would, would get around that pretty well. Um does that last two days out of ten games completed only two hours, just opponent left you was one before so not a rage quit makes sense. The balance circuit surprised well as class valid, another clearly OP. That's true, that's true. They did. And I'm gonna try other playstyles as well. Yeah, because I mean if he's specializing in melee, I don't feel like the pistol shot is gonna do much. Yeah, against the marked target, that's great and all. So that it's not just the shield breaker, like he can pressure that too. Ah, uh, I don't know. I just felt, if I had the A-bomb, what could I have done? Well, the A-bomb, when the A-bomb is human, the A-bomb can puke. He can do Beast's Bile, but he can only do it to positions two and three. Otherwise, yeah, but at least, no, no, that doesn't work very well either. I would, I, plus, I want to try out the Highwayman some more anyway. Plus, I mean, if we're using that anyway, hmm. <laughs> Maybe I need to put some debuff resistance in my build. How high? What, what, what trinkets? I never, I never respected debuffs before, but I'm starting to respect them now. That, that was a scary one. Uh, no, no, no. Left click. No, don't, don't, don't remove him. 
What can I get for debuffers? How high can I get it through a trinket? Let's see. 15, 15, 30. I feel like it's uncommon though. Like I feel like I shouldn't change the composition too much. But I do feel like I have a weakness. But I think if I just spammed poison more with, with Antiquarian, and yeah, maybe I could put a bleed on my Highwayman, because I, I very rarely need to use Pistol Shot. And this is just good, uh... Yeah, because of the death blow chance. It makes it so I have another person can, that can finish. But at the same time, it's only positions one and two. But that's why my, my bounty hunter can pull. But then it's a marked target, so the gun would do more damage. But it's minus 15%, this is plus 15%, and these modifiers go to damage. So I don't know how, how much higher that marked would really make a difference. So I feel like you're better off, unless I'm targeting the one in the back with this, which I wouldn't do. I would do something else instead. And then there's this as well. I mean, plus 30% damage, plus 10 accuracy, plus 8% crit? That's so good, dude. Hmm. I feel like that's a must. You need Duelist Advance. Arguably, I mean, Point Blank Shot is nice. But how often am I actually going to use it? Yeah, because they weren't touching him. I didn't get that much value out of my Highwayman. But if I could have applied this bleed... But that's just so rare, but I don't want to have it as a weakness. Or otherwise, in position one, I would just use point... Uh, I would use Wicked Slice instead of Point Blank. Because honestly, yeah, it's a higher death blow chance, but I'm not usually going to be killing the front line first anyway. So I don't know if Point Blank is worth it. It's got a... You know, it's the same crit mod in my... my yeah, 15% damage. So 30 versus 50. Uh, it's more accurate, though. It is more accurate, that is true. So it's more likely to connect. Uh, and the knockback is like okay, but it's like not super necessary. Maybe rock this, but I want to. Mm, yeah, maybe rock this. So if something. If my if my damage is nerfed way too much, I can bleed him. I think this will make him a better jack of all trades. So the idea that we pop duelist advance, and then we pop this. Yeah, yeah. So he'll hit really hard, and he'll crit with like a high chance too. And then it's mostly about spamming Wicked Slice, I guess. Or if my Shield Breaker pushes bad to this. I don't know. It's tough, though. Point Blank Shot's nice. Also has good Shackle Stun. Yeah, he does have the good Shackle Stun, that's true. Vendetta is quite sick. It is. It's a crazy buff. 30 damage, 10 accuracy, 8 crit. That's so good. Well, Balance Play Market Party or Stress Build that does not trigger a post. There's no place for creativity outside of newbie ranks. Well, Balance Mark Party or Stress Build that does not trigger repost. Oh, yeah, 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 like what I just fought. Or, or with an Arbalist. Well, quickest there's no place for creativity. So you think there's like some meta? Big X pop, I think you're like, all right, I'm gonna go sleep, I'm gonna get up early. All right, sure thing, Rappy, have a good sleep. I love you very much. We're, we're about to end. How remember design quite well. You can use Vendetta first round and use Duelist every other round and point blank every other. I kind of want to initiate with Duelist though, because I mean, he might get hit right off the bat, you know? The repose lasts for like what three turns or something? I'd want to use, du like I'd want to start with him duelist advance. So right away, if they try to pressure my highwayman, they'll get punished. Um, and then vendetta later, so that when he does get punished, uh, when, when they do try to punish him, he hits hard. My shield breaker. Hmm. Instead, my shield breaker will use the advancing stab, which pushes the highwayman back, so he can refresh the repose with duelist advance, which also lets him hit up to position three. So I think, I think the only problem is it's not as bursty. Like, I have to get this buff off. It's not really until turn three that he starts poking people with the damage imprint. But it's, 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 it's less vulnerable to movement. And this makes me less vulnerable to uh, tanky Bellow. Dude, Bellow is insane. That damage reduction was bad. So at least I do have some dots in my build. He's got the bleeding stab and he has a finisher. Dude, if I could actually get another finisher, I would consider putting it on. What, what's it, uh... Yeah, this thing. Plus 20. Oh, I forgot there was the accuracy thing too. Plus 25% depth. I mean, it's not super necessary, but it helps. But yeah, I'll probably try some point blank shot as well, but that'd be the. I don't know. I'll start with this. Um, as for shield breaker, yeah, I could get some dots. Puncture is a must. This is so good. I destroyed that other comp with it. Of course, Pierce is amazing. Expose is the only thing I would consider dropping. Um. But, like...
Wait, I didn't realize it. Crits receive chance plus 20. Oh my god, I didn't realize they're more likely to get critted. That's insane. So I counter stealth builds with this. But if I ran Captivate, yeah, you can apply a pretty nasty poison. Or even Impale for a little bit of AoE poison. But I'd have to give up Expose. And I kind of like Expose. It's, it's come in clutch quite a bit. But at the same time, the anti Corian isn't doing as much now. She'll probably spam Festering Vapors pretty on in preparation for that. And rejuvenating Vapors when it looks like we could use some help. Flash powder if I need a de-stealth. But yeah, see, she has her own de-stealth. Do we really need two de-stealths? Hmm. There's definitely some room for experimentation here. I see it. I see it. And then who's left? Who have I not looked at? No, that's it, right? Oh, bounty hunter. You don't... You don't... You have caltrops. I could put caltrops on, actually. But what would I give up for it? I use all of these things. Mark for death is really good if, um... Well, I don't, that's like what I'm giving. Like, I marked targets at the end of that one fight because I was like, he might not be able to do the death blow. He might die, and he did die. So it's like, mark them, and then my other teammates have a better chance of doing the finish. But arguably, we could drop it. Um, collect bounty. But I mean, yeah, if you, if you, if you come hither, follow with collect bounty, that's good damage. I could drop Mark for Death and run uh, Caltrops instead for Dots. But this might be a little bit overkill. We might not need this much. Besides, that's not how I would initiate anyway. I would do that towards the end, and by that point, it's probably not worth it. Two points per round for 25 rounds. Ah! Uh, no, 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 that's, that's not much, dude. I don't think I would do that. I say keep this. We do use Mark targets sometimes. I need to realize which abilities I'm not using much and see how I could replace them. Highway Repost is only two. Wait, let me see. Uh, move back and forth. Highway repost is only two. Oh, two turns. Okay, got it. Our blessed have a skill that debuffs 25% stress receive and decreases stress dealt to back two characters. Let me see it. Is it this one? Bypass stealth, de stealth. All heroes, clear stun, clear daze, clear mark target, clear debuffs. Is that the one? Is there any melee ability that hits four heroes? Or three, other than Hellion's Breakthrough? Like, all four a melee ability? Like, at the same time, hitting all four? I don't think so, no. Flashman's good with the high Blight because he hits two back characters counts as melee. Ah. Try Breakthrough Spam with the Blight on melee texture. It worked kind of well. Breakthrough Spam. Isn't that... this one? Oh, Blight on melee. So you Blighted the front three. That sounds like it'd be pretty handy. I didn't even think about that. Yeah, because there's a trinket where you Blight on melee. That's true. The second ability. Alright. At any rate, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm really enjoying this theory crafting, but we're already 13 minutes over time. I need to wrap up the stream. I am enjoying this. I may actually return to it. This game looks pretty cool. Who would want to see more of this game? Who, who in chat would actually want to see more of this game? I don't think it would be like in the near future, but I may return to this relatively soon. Me, me? Okay. Okay. We may return to this soon, and maybe I'll experiment with other builds. I'm in favor. Wave me. Okay. Alright. We might do more in the near future. <laughs> Anyways, but we need to wrap things up. If you liked what you saw and you want to see more, well, first off, thank you all for tuning in. I hope you had fun. If you liked what you saw and you want to see more, please feel free to leave a follow. It helps out a lot. You see every time I go live, I stream every single day starting at 12 p.m. Central and ending at 4 p.m. Central. So make sure you follow me to catch me next time. If you like this video, please leave a like and comment. It does help out a lot. I do upload a new video to the streams channel, this channel, and the Reacts channel every single day. So make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss out. Join my Discord, Level 3 Discord server, tons of dragon emotes. We'd love to have you with us. You're missing out if you're not already in there. Follow me on Twitter for daily stream updates, edited clips, fan art, memes, gaming news, mood-related stuff you don't want to miss out. And you can follow me on Instagram, TikTok, uh, subreddit, and Facebook page as well. All these links are in the description in the fan art and uh, the panels below the stream. But that's going to be it for tonight. Thank you for tuning in. Hope you had fun. And I'll catch you next time.